Hello. We're here. So we're kind of oh, late. We're what are we not? Twenty three minutes late as oh, usual. We well, we're here this time. We didn't, yeah. you know, not tell you we weren't gonna be here. Yeah, we did it, guys. We actually got here. Yeah. We, we actually showed up. We did it. Don't you scared. remember the good old days we were all on at like 7.30 and we started at 7.30 like on nope. the dot every uh, single yeah, time? Like 80 sessions ago. Yeah. I was going to say, yeah, I was going to say like that was probably... That was like session, session one, five sessions. maybe session two. Session zero, I think we were all on a time. <laughs> yeah, but that wasn't like an event, though. It wasn't like we didn't stream session zero. Yeah, I think I, I, <laughs> that was just session real. zero, I just sent out a big document. Yeah. I know, I just slept. Well, welcome everyone that is true. to the Elysia campaign. Whatever episode this is. What is this episode? Like 70? 73, I think? 74? 73? Wow. 73. Yeah, 73. Look at that. Look Ooh. at that. Ooh. Ah, crazy. Crazy, crazy, Long crazy. Well, welcome to episode 73 of the Elysia stream. We're dungeon delving today. So I hope everyone's excited for that. Possibly dragons. More dungeons. More dragons. Nah, the there's, only, there's only one dragon in, in like Elysia this time period. Meepo's oh, Meepo's too, yeah. controlling it right now. We well, kind of have the, the oh, God, suspicious one in our dragon. It's in our inn. Dragon. We technically have a dragon in our inn. He is right. Yeah, that is true. Actually, yeah, we have a dragon there too. Oh, uh, we haven't confirmed that, but yeah, all so, signs. Yeah, we're making a lot dragon. of assumptions about him. <laughs> all, yeah. all signs point to dragon. Yeah. Horde. Yeah, the dwarf guy. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, our not our not dwarf. We're like ninety nine percent sure he's a dragon. <laughs> we can't you can just prove ask it. somebody if they're a dragon, though. You can't just. Yeah, you can't just are you a dragon? I, I, we probably you could ask him. I mean, he lives on our inn for free. Like, he looks. He from, might tell like, you. We learned. I don't think anyone's girls. directly asked him about his life. No, we kind of all just, just assume somebody if they're a dragon. Yeah. Just like in Mean Girls, you can't just ask somebody why they're white. That's true. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, no, that's <laughs> the main thing. Yeah. Uh, anyways, uh, we're gonna go ahead and get started here. Quick recap. You guys did your big battle against Tor and his assassins from the Order of Kalis. You fought them back. Uh, Ruma decided not to uh, join and maintain with his order and fought back also. So the party's on some pretty uh, pretty loose terms with him right now. I'm not really sure what's going on there. But then it became a matter of figuring out, all right, we've got these assassins coming after us. What are we going to do? They ended up deciding to uh, explore the... Uh, oasis that this town, this Cellos town, is built next to. Uh, Dr. Watts dove underwater, found a structure under there with a magical circle, uh, took a picture of it. Uh, both Destiny and Kumi, the reincarnation of the goddess, air quotes, um, were able to read it, could open that for you, which you guys were like, all right, open it for us. Uh, but if we don't come back in a few days, you know, you guys need to figure something out here because this Order of Kalis business is they're doing everything in their power to, like, subplant the pontiff and, you know, take control of things from the shadows. And this isn't good stuff. So you guys have opted to explore why there are nine rumors on my screen right now. And uh, you guys have opted to... <laughs> Fun you guys have fun. opted to explore why uh, why Kumi has these powers and who she's been communicating with that have given her these powers. So you entered what is called the Palace of the Archons. Uh, you fought some gargoyles on a bridge. Darby almost got thrown off to his death, but uh, Jamie yeah. was able to throw him like a jetpack, basically, and you know keep him jet up shoes. on his up on his feet. Jet shoes. And uh, yeah, that is where we ended last session, relatively <laughs> anticlimactically, with you beating like three pissy little gargoyles. And yeah, they weren't pissy; they were pretty tough. Yeah, they're trying, they're they trying were to not happy. They, off, yeah. they were they were trying to throw people off. They would have yeah. killed I it was a good Darby. Well, maybe not <laughs> killed, but I would have been in a world of Darby would have been super dead. Darby. Yeah, Ninety six. I would uh, shot him. Won't necessarily kill me, but it would probably knock me unconscious, depending on how that's bad that it is. Too. Remember, I, t I said I would have shot you. I That's true. Yeah. Because he... Because I have my reaction. Just, his, his thought process was, I'll just shoot him. That'll oh, be he's, fun. He's falling. He must me. I must make this work. <laughs> not throw oh, right, a rock at him. him. You damaged yeah, him. Because yeah, like, I have a, a 60 foot funny. misty step on reaction that makes me invisible. What's funny? When I take I, damage. I, I don't... 100% know the rule, but I think you can accept 
damage. Like, you could just say, I will let this hit me. So, Darby, you could just be like, yes, I will take the bullet. Like, but, I will do nothing. But the real dodge. question is, why would Azrael shoot him? Yeah, yeah. That's what maybe, I was saying. The, the maybe, only... I knew, maybe we talked about it. Maybe I know there's an instinct. But Darby, you didn't. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's the thing. You, like, don't know, if... you don't know what I talked to Darby about. But yeah, also, why don't you, that's true. why don't you throw a but rock also at very, like, him? Like, literally anything you, other than shoot him. <laughs> Okay, let's be honest. Do you think if I asked real through a rock, it would actually hit Darby? Yes. No. Yes. <laughs> the better question is, would it actually do damage? <laughs> because I One have to damage, damage. Yes. better than it, zero. It's like that meme of the guy that shoots the guy in the chair and then turns to like the camera and says something. <laughs> why it's did like, you do that? It's like yeah, Asriel why? shoots Darby. Why didn't Darby misty step yeah, out? Yeah, of yeah. <laughs> He's dead. He critically how, hit how him. He's dead do though. That? Why would you do that? Yeah. I don't. I don't have fast anything. That's true. <laughs> I, mean, I got you guys have All seen right, me you... do it before, but that doesn't necessarily mean that's like your first thought is, oh yeah, he can just do that whatever he wants. Like you don't know why I do it or how I do it. You just I'm know that when I get hit, observant. I disappear. Yeah. I just and so my head scan it is that the party just like understands that ability, but yeah. I mean, heck, I don't know how you guys feel. <laughs> it's not like anyone's asked why or how that works. Because there's like, there's like, I mean, all anyone knows about your entire magical existence is currently you're indebted to a lady that loves cats and yeah. seemingly you. Pretty much, yeah. And I've never asked questions. Uh, no, <laughs> no, no, no questions. They're just like, yeah, sure, you've oh, got, you've you. got a mommy, Dami. Oh. And yeah. that is the Darby has a madam. He had a, he does, pimp, he does. And now he has a madam. Like, oh. like, Dr. Darby's Jamie impressive. Watts has been like on the game this entire time. He's like, yep, yeah, no, yeah. I've seen working girls before and, I get and, it. And all of the things that have happened to us, Darby having a cat mommy really isn't the strangest. Like, even no, it's it's the weirdest thing. Things it, is, it is arguably one of the no. most normal things. Yeah. Yeah. Can yeah. we not that refer to her as cat mommy? That comes below giant <laughs> house with hands for feet. Like, that comes yeah. way below. Yeah. Uh, we will be calling her cat mommy. I, I, vote, I vote we stop calling her cat. I, I, I or, this well, that's what I or, or we'll her. just call her Darby's mommy then and call it a day. There there we we also I was going to say, that. Kitty Madam. <laughs> Kitty Madam is Kitty. also. Kitty Madam. Uh, Kitty Pussy Madam. Galore was my other option. Oh, there we go. Oh, little yeah. James Bond. Oh, I was going to make another James Bond song quote and I forgot to. If no one realized it last time I quoted song license to kill from the james bond movie license to kill and i was gonna keep doing it until i got to something really obvious like goldfinger and then i just say something that referenced goldfinger i ruined my own joke anyways you guys are on a bridge right now we are, we're on a bridge. anyway we're on a bridge <laughs> yep. so i do not remember initiative order or who left off so we're gonna start from the top with darby i was top i think it's Darby, Sentinel, Jamie, Ruma, and then Azriel was the order. And we're just going to keep that order to for ease of you. So we're starting with you, Darby. We're kicking it off. And I will go ahead and just start making my way across the bridge. Making my way down. down. And Spades will follow behind me. Oh, no. He gets his own initiative. That is true. However, he does not get his own exploration initiative. Allegedly. Uh, yeah, you can, you can see all this shit. All that shit? Oh boy, we got some hobby boys. And whatever that gaping mod down there is. Why you gotta call Wait, it what? that? This like, thing? That's like the only thing I can see of it is it's clearly just a giant open mouth. Oh yeah, it's just a big open mouth. I don't know what it is. So Darby, you approach? The armored badger. Sorry, I'm gonna stop that. <laughs> <laughs> Ruba just, just throws down a, a car. Oh, <laughs> Prince of oh, Ari comes boat. to save us. I heard you needed help. <laughs> I saw in our uh, D and D Beyond thing because I had to double check something about one of the characters that Prince of Farin is not level twenty in our campaign. <laughs> oh yeah, no, Doug, Prince of Arin, uh is level twenty immediately after he left you guys. <laughs> I love it. We were holding so them a back. massive pair of stone doors <laughs> lies broken just south of the small plaza, flanking by iron torches that brightly illuminate the area. One door lists unevenly on its bottom hinge, and the other lies shattered on the ground. The standing door is carved with pastoral scenes of grain fields and rolling hills, uh, worn and pitted by the centuries. A large dim light hall waits beyond the broken gates. Arrow slits are carved into the west and east walls. I gotta turn this music down. It's way too loud. I would have done like 30%. Yeah, 
Also, I apologize if anyone's like Discord blew up. I was just working on the spot trying to figure out how to make it work. So I, I will did say I it. did find it quite humorous that like an hour before we started, I just randomly got a message on Discord. That said help? Yeah, the dungeon manager just said just the word was just help. <laughs> I was like, oh no. <laughs> I yeah. thought that was very funny. Uh, it's just like, huh, that. Well, <laughs> I didn't respond. I could have been like, my friend looks like they did said help. I won't just, do anything about that. Just assume if I call that. for help, it's me testing a Discord I, bot. I, I, Unless I it's not. in real life, then I probably need help. <laughs> He's testing even, a Discord bot in real life. Didn't, yeah. didn't even check on it. Nope. That shows you how cool I am. <laughs> just... Oh, so, man. Darby, as you approach and you can kind of see through all of this corridor here, you actually see these creatures here almost seemingly form out of the sand, screaming bloody murder as their existence is immediately crafted before your eyes. Oh, oh, that's fun. Yeah, no, that's what that's what I wanted to do with today. And with that, let me knock everyone off here because I don't think anyone can see their initiatives anymore. We're going to need initiative uh, again. Initiative time? <laughs> Oh dang, we're already in it. They're just like, we're gonna kill you. We just were created and yeah. we're gonna kill we, you. We just were painfully brought into this existence and we're going to painfully take you out. I only know one thing, and that's killing. <laughs> that's right. That is pain yes, and should start going by Sonic right because in, right, so fast. No longer snow. So wait, are they, these are like sand beings? They, they were formed out of sand. But yeah. they appear to be sentient now. Yes. Check, make sure that is correct. This is the they... of the Archon, so the Archons are... Uh, oh, yeah, I don't need to see yeah. them. They were formed... Uh, what is, I guess I can't see them yet, so I'll talk about it later. You're hanging out on this rock over yeah. here, bro. Yeah, I'm, I'm hanging just out. Oh, yeah. back. We got sand people! <laughs> yeah, we got sand people out here. <laughs> What's the, um, uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, the <laughs> <laughs> Star Wars? Yeah. Star Wars, the sand people. I love that we all did the same yeah. thing. It's so great. I do not remember the noise they make, but I know what. The Tuscan Raiders. Yeah, no, I know what you're talking about. I just don't remember the noise. The it's been so long. Like they're like a seal. Yeah, they're yeah. teal. They were like seal people. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Well, Arthur. I love like too in the original the like movie. They were just like these interesting nomads that just randomly attack Luke Skywalker and you're just yeah. like, what in the hell are these things? They're just, they're aliens, yeah. And they're just sand people. Yeah, like, they're, they're just, just people they're in just the sand. sand people. Yeah. yeah, we're used to these guys. You don't want to deal with them, but they're sand people. They're just there. They live in the sand. And they're people. Not until the prequels, they became Tusken Raiders. Ooh. I mean, probably good. Because I feel like some house... Sand, yeah, sand, sand people, it feels like there's, like a, there's getting, a connotation getting, there, you know? Yeah, I feel like, like someone it, it feels that. a little wrong. Someone said something fun, that way yeah, yeah. to the wrong group of people and should be punished for it. Yeah, no. That is a lot of 20s. Uh, yeah, Azrael, well. what is your dex? My dex is uh, 20 yeah. plus 5. Dang. They will go before everyone else, and they will keep their order since they all have the same ducks. Uh, Let me make like, sure there's no other ties. With uh, me, Dr. Watt, I'm going to assume person. yours is higher than these guys because I don't think they have a very good dex. And uh, then, I am Darby, also what's tied your at familiar? 19. I have an 18 in my dexterity, which is probably higher. Yes, you will be higher. Uh, and then, what is Spades' dex? Uh, that is a good question. It's like a, I know it's a plus two. It's a 15. I, I think you beat these things, so he that actually goes before this other guy. Wow. I get to go They're before They're not my very dexterous. Uh, yeah, you definitely go before him. All right, uh, Azriel, uh, you hear Darby call out uh, that these things there are, are sand people the here. Sand, <laughs> screaming to life, bloody murder. Okay, these and they do players. seem hostile. 10, 20, 30. And then I'm going to bonus action dash for 10, okay. 20, 30. Um, if I, my movement ends there, um, am I allowed to peek around the corner and shoot or no? I did not make it to the corner. I did not make it around. You did not make it to the corner. You may not. You guys, it's 10 feet. If it was five, I might allow that makes it. Sense. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, yeah. then for my action, 10, 20, 30, it'll put me just right in a, there. Ooh, good question. Um, I guess I will hold my action. In case one of them, which I don't think is going to happen, one of them makes it up this way. Okay. That's where I can uh, which square specifically? This one. So if they if they get all the way up here, 
because I can't see around the corner. So that's what I'm going to hold okay. my action. All right, the Something burrow shark more. is going to go next. Burrow shark. It's a cool name. Ten, twenty, thirty, and it is going to take cover behind this pole. That's not so much. First sand hop goblin goes. It remains where it is and takes cover behind the pole. The next one does the same thing. Darby, you are next. Do I want to go in there? I don't think I want to go in there. Uh, which one? We still have a lot of dungeons. Two on the left are the ones that have taken cover. Yeah. So the burrow shark is behind the pole yeah uh i believe let me double check just to make sure i'm not wrong yep and then these two on the left yeah, are the behind the cover right now. okay can i see either of these two on the roof? uh yes, they have not taken cover so their uh, ac increase will not be as high but you okay. can see so them. they're they're partial yes they are uh, half covered yeah that's that's fine that's fine i Got a decent two hit. I will chuck a card at the front right one or the top right one. Okay, go ahead. Give me a roll. Uh, uh ooh, that is a twenty-five to hit. That will hit. Uh, that is eight force on the first card. Takes eight force. And then Darby will chuck a second card at the same target. Uh, that is an 11. Uh, it bounces <laughs> off of the pole. I kind of figure. Do I want to walk in there? Not particularly. Uh, so I will back up 10, 20, uh, 10. You got this, Darby. Take them on. 20, 30. <laughs> okay. Darby I'll just pass by cool. Arthur and be like, I'm yeah. not going in there first. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> That, that your whole turn, Darby. Uh, bonus action, spades can attack. That's it. Okay. Uh, Hobgoblin to the south right will uh, will oh, take some, cover. That one. Some hidden bullies. An unseen enemy moves. Dr. Watts, you are next. What? Uh, an unseen Whoa. enemy. It's I mean, a rumor. <laughs> what about my passive perception? Uh, it is unseen because it is a completely different room. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. He, he's somewhere we can't um, see. Hence well, I'm pretty is far unseen. away, I so I'm gonna go and find out where he's at. 10, 20, 30. This is about as far as I can go. And then I will take the dodge action. Okay. And yeah, that's all I can really do right now. All right. Another oh, unseen right. enemy moves. Oh, duh. Oh no! Another. I bet you he's right there. Unseen <laughs> enemy moves. I bet you he's right behind and that And finally, uh, our last uh, hobgoblin. Oh, can you see his little health bar? No. No. I hovered over him at just the right time, and I saw the corner of the box that was outside of the. Oh. Dark ah. yeah. <laughs> uh, the other, the uh, other hobgoblin takes defensive positioning behind the pillar. You are upset. I like this defensive position. I, I will. Yeah, uh, yeah. Also mention Bob as I come back, it. they are they are hiding behind pillars currently. Throw a stick of dynamite in there. Yeah, and there yeah, are five creatures. Stick of dynamite. Anyone got? Anyone ball. got an explosive? A fireball, maybe? Eh. Some alchemist fire to just chuck in there. Well. Well. Actually, I was well. like there was like a five. Yeah. One in Rome. Rage. Uh, I mean, hey. so we're gonna go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. They are 10 30. foot square. What? They are? Yeah. Well, then I'm yeah. not really going anywhere. 5, yeah, what, 10, 10, 20, yeah, 30, we're all 40. Here because we can't move very far. And then my flight speed. So, look at that. Don't rage then. Don't rage. So then I am not raging. Yeah, I wouldn't rage. And I also will take up defensive positioning <laughs> and puff out my chest. There you go. All right. That's it. An unseen enemy moves. Darby, like your familiar it. is next. Uh, I like this. Spades will just kind of. Well, Spades will come over. Uh, 
flap his little wings on Arthur, and Arthur feels a little bit luckier on the next shot that he takes and has uh, the help action. Sweet. And then Spades there will just kind of flutter back over here. Mm. Anything else for you, Spades? That is all Spades will do. An unseen enemy moves. Oh. Ruma, you are next. Ruma. Is there enough room for me to squeeze by these individuals? You can always squeeze by everyone. It's 10 feet. Yeah, it's and 10 besides feet. allies, I allow you to go by. Okay. You just osmosis through their body. I yes. love that. I'm going to go. Jones. I'm going to go here and look at Darby real confused and go, is this where the queue starts? And I'm going to walk through. <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> and then I'm going to dash and We're that'll put me right there. Ugh. And that is my whole action before I make a defensive maneuver, except for it's just me covering my face. <laughs> Azrael, you are next. Azrael Ruma has given go. himself the blinded 10, condition. 20, <laughs> they now have advantage on him, but he is a wall. Dash with a bonus action. 10, 20, 30. Stop! Ah. Three enemies are taking a reaction against you. You uh, Javelins are Chuck chucked at you from arrow slits in the side wall here. They've activated my trap card. <laughs> yeah, this Stop. isn't the Dying. real Azrael. Yes. This is actually a double uh, does, a, does a 19 hit you for the first Ooh, one? Just a shock ult. Yeah. We'll yeah. Alright, Azrael, you are going to take... You've been javeled. Ooh, ouch. Uh, eight piercing damage. All right, I'll be eight Here comes the next words. one. That is right. definitely going to miss at a 10. I thought it was going to be Jim Carrey with javelins in my legs. And 21. <laughs> 21 will hit. You are Jim Carrey. Uh, that'll be five yeah. damage to you. All right. So <laughs> javelin in each <laughs> you, may, you may resume your turn, Asriel. All right. Asriel will uh, look down at both javelins in both his legs. He'll scream at both of them. And then he will... <laughs> Unsheath his uh, white devil and shoot at this guy who's clearly. You are visible. unable to. He has full cover. What? What is this? All the enemies below you have full cover. You are unable to hit them with ranged attacks. Full cover. Oh, wait. Okay. Above you? Below you? All four of these guys have full cover at his positioning. What about this oh. guy? I can see him between the pillars, correct? He also, he also has full cover. What okay. is going on? All right. How they are hiding behind these. These are very large pillars. The pillars do not quite sure, represent no, the size no, of the I, pillars. They're like, they're like backed up against it. I got you. No worries. Yep. I'm confused. Are um, we above them? No, no you are at the same level. Below in the sense of on the map, map they are. Like, I see, I see. Yes, okay. yes. Below us in I was relation like, to the map. Is there like itself. a thing on this? No, okay, there's, no, there's no height map difference. It's just. Understood. I guess. Always hold an action for when one of them comes out of cover. Oh, hold on. I've got, um... Or potentially have things I'm you can going throw. to make, um... I'm going to use my action to panache this gentleman right here. You can't do okay. that. I can. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> as an action, you may make a persuasion <laughs> check contested by the creature's insight. I'm he gonna. make a contested okay. insight check against me. Go ahead, give me your roll. 28. Seven. Whoa. Um, so on a success, the hostile creature has disadvantage on attack rolls against targets and can't make any opportunity attacks against targets other than me for one whole minute. Or until okay. one of my allies engages it, or it gets more than 60 feet from me. Alright. Anything else for you, Asriel? That's it. That's all oh, my move, bonus action, and action. Alright, the Burrow Shrek's gonna go. It's gonna go 10, 20, 30, and it's gonna make three scimitar attacks against you. Okay. The thing's got arms? Yeah, you can like just Technically, it's a guy riding it. Oh. 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 It's oh, a I mouse. see what you did there. Oh, yeah. That is a non natural 20. No, 22, excuse me. Oh, that'll hit, sir. Oh, uh, yeah, so non natural right, 22. It a... uh, that know. will be uh, 11 points of piercing. Uh, yeah, probably... yeah, yeah. That will miss Please. at a 10. No. And that will miss at an 11. Huh. Sweet. Oh, 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 oh. This sand hobgoblin is going to move up. 
And actually, no, he's not going to move up that far. He's going to stay back here. He's going to... Uh, one more. One more so he can see you. He's going to use his longbow against you. Okay. That will be a 17. That'll miss. Hey. That'll miss. Strike Arrow away. goes right. Then this one's going to go right here, and he's going to make a longsword attack against you. Sure. That will be a non-natural 20. That'll hit. Ooh, okay. He's going to get extra damage on this attack sure. because of the ally. So he is going to do uh, 17 points of damage to you. Ooh. As a part of my reaction, I'm going to do um, uncanny dodge and half that. So half of okay. 17 would be 8 then. Right? One sec, just double checking something. Yep, you are allowed to do that to all the damage. I wanted to make sure it wasn't a separate uh, set of damage you were getting hit with. So it would be 8 then, right? Yep, it's 17, yep. it'll be so 8. Half. Okay. Yep. Yes. Darby, you're next. Yes, I am. How many spell slots do I have? I have not used any. Uh, so Darby will go 10, 20. I'm going to sneak around Sentinel here. And I uh, guess... Go ahead and summon the boy! Got 90 That's feet the here. Uh, so we'll toss him here right there. Here comes that boy! Here comes the boy! The boy who needs to be updated. Every time. That boy! But that is okay. <laughs> Got 80 and 17 AC. Uh, so that is action, bonus action, spades can't attack, and then I've got 10 more feet of movement that I will just kind of casually snake around Sentinel again. Uh, as for Bouncer, uh, we'll just go Despair again, as per usual. So that's the, re chaos. the reduced movement one, uh, and it is not a Chaos Bouncer, just a normal Bouncer. But then the Bouncer gets to do things. Okay. He's gonna start swinging his big old fists at, uh... At the Hang Hobgoblin and to and the and south. And okay. And uh, that is a 15 to hit. That will miss. He parries your attack. But we'll the wrong damage. Or blocks because okay. parries an actual ability. Yeah. Uh, he will go for the second punch. The uppercut, okay. if you will. Hits him uh, for... What is that? That is a 23. That way. We got max damage. Love to see it. Uh, plus eight awesome. is 20 cold damage right to the face. Nice. 20. The sand hob goblin dissipates back to the sand from which he came. Nice. Uh, that is both attacks, and he will just kind of stand there menacingly, cracking his knuckles. All right. So this one's going to go. It is going to step up from its perch, and it's going to attack your bouncer, Darby. Of course. I'd like to see him try. Ooh, uh, natural 20 on that one. That oh. does, in fact, hit, yes. He did try. Okay, he that tried. He, he, he certainly tried. tried. Yeah, no, he, he gave it his best. I, that you know, gotta, that is going to actually be quite a bit of damage on this yeah, guy. Yeah, because I get the, the bonus for having the ally, too. Yep. It's going to be 46 a and good amount. Yep. It's gonna hurt. Bouncer should survive, See. though. I didn't roll great. Actually, I rolled pretty good. Uh, <laughs> uh, 20, 23. The duality of DM. Yeah. 23. I'm assuming Got it's just two ones on that, normal slashing damage, I assume. That is his whole turn. Okay. Azrael, you're taking another javelin attack from the... Uh, Holes in the wall. Okay. Can friggin' find there. Azrael, that will definitely miss at a, a nine. Yes, that misses. Dr. Watts, you're next. Okay, um, so how long has it been since the gargoyle? Like, it's like, it's literally just like been a few it, seconds. Basically, seconds. maybe a minute or two after. Okay, cool. So then I still have a fly speed. That's what I was Yeah, me too. Yeah. Yeah, we both. All right, so I'm going to go. Come on, buddy. Uh, 10, 20. Yeah, no. 10, 20, 
30, 40. Then I'm going to dash, bonus action, 10, 20, 30. As I see him enter that area, I will I will use a speech if I can to oh, let yeah. him know that there are holes on the sides of where I'm standing where people are firing javelins. So if he's going to come out here, like, be prepared to be attacked. Oh, cool. Um, I believe they're coming from here and here, right? I just got yeah, uh, all the just, just, uh, uh, just on your right or the okay. right of the map. Oh, okay. Okay. just the right side. Well, then, in that case, good looking out. Mm -hmm. Then I will use my. Mm. No, I'll still go in. I, I, at least yeah. I'll know, but I yeah. will. Yeah. I'm still going to you. Um, if I get attacked, I get attacked. That's right. And. I am going to use my one free uh, elixir, magic elixir, which I rolled for, and it was the healing. So you're going to get a two. Azrael is going to get a 2d4 plus four healing boost. Give me one nice. second while I roll that dice. Do, 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 do. That is a whopping 11. Nice. Ooh. Thank you. 11 HP. And that is all my turn. All right, Dr. Watts, you're going to get javelin attacked here. Makes sense. Time to do that. Well, Dr. <laughs> Watts, unless 10 hits you, you're all right. I am all right. Because oh, I warned you. Right. You did. I yeah, was, I was, warning. Oh, I was ready. You're fighting in Dr. Watts' <laughs> javelin. Azrael warns you, this javelin just like flies across your face, sticks the wall. <laughs> but the, the next unseen enemy will go, but he won't be that unseen because he is going to go... 10, 20, 30, and an enlarged Duogar appears and will oh, attack no. your bouncer. He just walked right through that pillar, too. Are. That's crazy. It's like uh, a, he went, he went, he went, went through the Hobgoblin. Okay. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, he can go for it. He can try. He can try. Yeah, they're that basically is going like to be a non under Dark Horse. Uh, 18, 18. Uh, that is one over. Uh, 11 piercing. That is 11 piercing. He has resistance to necrotic, just so. And your, uh, bouncer is getting attacked again. Yeah, no, Man, necrotic. bouncer's yeah, not no. doing dude. That, Necrotic is that not That is another na poor natural 20 on your, ha on uh, your guy. I mean, he's doing know. what he's here for, so. Yeah. And thankfully, he doesn't need to still be there for the movement reduction. As long as they start their turn next to him, they lose 20 feet of movement. Which he did. Soaking up that D. Yeah, no, I mean, hey. He's, he's got 80 yep. HP for a reason. Yep. Hear that. I want you to hear 28 that. 28 points of damage. <laughs> How much was I it? 20 said something? It. 20? 28. 28. Okay. Still up. Oh, God. I don't, the bouncer is looking real bad. The remorse. flames are starting to flicker, but he's he's there. <laughs> All of his shadow flames. I will not be suppressed. <laughs> Come on, Sentinel Marvel Snap Time. Just yeah. run in and snap your wing. Snap now that it's Eddie. Nick's turn, I just want everybody to know that he's got this perfect 90s heartthrob hair going on right yeah. now. I don't know if everybody else him, noticed it, but I can, I can, yeah. I have. They can see him. Look at it. It's just, it's just like falling. Yeah. Ever, he's got that Jonathan it, Taylor he's Thomas. He's got that, that, that <laughs> Leonardo <laughs> DiCaprio and wow. all of his younger roles. Yeah. He's, doing, he's doing it for the fans. He's yeah. doing it for the fans. The Sentinel crew. The the roost. As the roost. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Sentinel, give us give I us like a show. That. Boost the roost. <laughs> boost the roost. Hashtag boost the roost. Hashtag boost the roost. <laughs> yeah. Here we we're go. Out here. We're going. <laughs> we're always out here. <laughs> Always out here roosting it up. Yeah. Roost, <laughs> roost the roost. Roost the roost. Okay. Sure. So. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Alrighty. Sounds like a radio show. 107.3. The roost. The roost. The roost. The roost. Boop, 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 boost the roost. Oh, yeah. This is the one that was panached, right? The one on the top right here? Yes, sir. Yes. Uh, did he roll at disadvantage? Oh, he did not. Thank Panash. you for reminding me. I like, just thought about, about that. Let too, me yeah. roll again. Uh, that roll actually would have been a 15. Oh, uh, that would actually miss. You may get your HP back yeah, then. That was my bad. I yeah. forgot. I he also, I like just remembered that that one there was Panash. I was like, wait, which yeah. one am I trying not to hit? Put a marker on him so that way we know. Yeah. It's like a green marker or something. That works too. I like that one. Yeah. Yeah. Because he will be dead activated. soon. <laughs> okay, so, so 
the sapphires pop up and they start swirling around. There's a, a couple that swirl around me, a couple that are around Jamie, oh, um, a couple Ooh. of them are around uh, Arthur, and all of us will have a plus one to our AC. Yeah. Love that. That's Love really that. good for where you guys are. Love that for me. Yeah. We're here for that. I'm What's okay the, with that. I'm assuming the range is 10 feet. Yes. So one tile. Okay. Show me that aura. I, I, that aura. I, 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 that aura. I don't know if everybody can see it. No. Nope. I got it. I fix. Do we know the need on you crying? There you go. There go. Even when I roll a d20, the second time that I roll, twice has been a one. <laughs> I, I'm so thankful I'm a barbarian, or else and get I would be. On everything. <laughs> I, I would be so ineffective. Yeah. As... Reckless or bust, baby. Reckless yeah. or bust. Okay. Uh, so that's a 27 to hit and a 26 to hit on this guy. That'll. Those will all hit him. I probably don't I need to have you roll for damage, but by all means, go ahead. Well, you might okay. even kill him oh, on the first oops. hit, depending on what your bonus is. I rolled the wrong die. Because if your first hit is over 20, it, it just it certainly dies. There's the one we all know and love, yep. and there's, there's the 12. The Just there we feast go. Of hey, over Moon, here. We played Moonrakers, you rolled four hazard dice, you um, got nothing at all. Also, also before that, I rolled two dice that were fall damage. Uh, okay, uh, yeah, so that's like 20... Something, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it super yeah. dissipates back into six. Because of his bonus okay. plus the rage bonus, which... You actually turned him to yeah. glass. Is your rage it bonus may plus have been like 30 damage. Uh, yes, it is. So it would be another six damage on top of that. So 12. Well, it, is, it is more dead than... than it is incredibly dead. dead. Perfect. That's it. That's all I can do. That's bonus section. Well, action Sentinel, you're getting shot by a javelin from the hole. Hit me. Oh, just catch it. Javelins. Use that two levels of monk you don't have and catch the javelin. That, that's a miss. Uh, Darby's familiar can go. Spades. Uh, oh, yeah, spades can go. and uh, Spades will... Make Ruma feel a little bit extra lucky. Give him the help action. Uh, yeah, and yeah, just yeah, kind of yeah. sit back here still. That's it? Oh, yeah. There's not a whole lot right. that Billiards can do at this level anymore. The Unseen attacks are so enemy hard to goes. hit. 10, 20, and it's an enlarged Duogar, and it's going to hurl a spear at Sentinel. Ooh. What a jerk. Wow, there goes all my good rolls. That is an eight. Ruma, nice. you are next. All right. All right Ruma enough. is super slow being all clogged up in the queue there. In the queue. In, in the, the queue. Up on that queue there. I mean, he did kind of cut the line yeah, a few a times. Mistakes up on the bobby. Yep. Yeah. All right. Um. I guess I will. Damn it, Sentinel. You're my spot. All right. All right. All right. I'm all right. sorry. It's fine. It's not your fault. You got a fat ass. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right. Wow. Um, Get with one of your attacks and then move him ten feet with Crusher. It's true. <laughs> can, can I move on this? Can I move on this angle for my thirty feet of movement? Yes. Okay. Yes, sweet. you may. So these javelins are coming. Are there? Is it like a little slit in the wall here? It is a little slit in the wall. Is it? Smash it. Oh, Smash the slit. slit in the wall. Mmm. Oh, I was gonna throw a Molotov cocktail in it. Yeah, burn yes. it. What do you have that is a Molotov cocktail? I have. That's amazing. I just saw it in my inventory. Oh, I took spells. Your that's hammer. Right. Yeah, but this it, seems funner. Okay, so I have a tinderbox. I have a flask of oil. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's, that's more a fire bomb than it is a yeah. Molotov. But that, yeah. All right. You are not next to it, Ruma. I will need you to roll me a throw, though, which will be based upon your dex. A ranged attack. Oh, boy. <laughs> you know what? We're going for it, because I don't feel like using spell slots to You see somewhere. Ruma blow out a thing of oil and light it, and he just lobs <laughs> it. Just All right, here it. we go. It's the man who's lost his faith right there. Yeah. <laughs> I got a nine. <laughs> Oof. I thank God I don't need to see oh, what wait. I need to roll for damage. Do I feel? You... Do I feel? What does the luckiness do? Uh, you get advantage on oh. your next ability check yeah. or attack roll. Yeah, advantage. Uh, that you get advantage. It's an attack roll. Seventeen. Yeah. yeah. I need. I, I just as I was saying, I don't need to look up what a Molotov cocktail would do for five e. But 
I don't now think you do. are like a real this thing. I'm pretty sure. There is. Yeah. There is. I'm pretty sure there was. There was a real one. Damn it! I'm just hoping they can't see out of the hole and keep yapping. All right. Down. Wow. <laughs> They do like decent damage. Turns out I've turned the javelins into flaming javelins and now I they know. do bonus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of a sudden, you see a flames erupt from inside the area. And at the start of their turns, they're all going to start taking damage. Azrael, nice, you're next. Unless nice. you, you had anything else. That was it. That's yeah. awesome. Dang, that that's great. Nice. That worked out. This weird yeah. slant shark rider dude is going to get hit with a scimitar. A skinny. Okay. Um, that is a 26 to hit. Nice. Yeah, you hit it, baby. All right. That's a sexy sack. Sack. Bro Shark Rider instead of Bro Shark. Bro it Shark Rider. I thought you said Bro Shark Rider. Bro Shark Rider. Like bro Shark. Bro Shark. Rider. <laughs> bro it's the Bro here. Shark. Yeah, dude. 29. Yeah, yeah, that'll hit. No, it's 29 damage. I don't think there's an enemy. Oh, you did 29 yeah. damage. So it takes 29. Yeah. Uh, I think there are like, I was like I don't know ridiculous, if there's an enemy in the game that, that has like 29 30. AC. I think there's right, stuff um, that I'm have, gonna like, hit 30s. him with the uh, the good old one two and hit him with the other scimitar. Mm, Give me the off. Not legal. But, you know that's like uh, things that you're not that, supposed to fight ever. Um, hey. a uh, 16 hit. That'll miss. Oh, he blocks dude. it with his sword or spear. Alrighty. Then I'm gonna go uh, 10, 20, and hold there. Okay. That's your turn, Azriel? It is. Great. You just gave me uh, room for your healer. He's gonna move up and attack you, Dr. Watts. Ah! Uh, dare he? This is a person, right? It's okay. Like, you have like, a plus one to your AC. It's a person on a thing. Yeah. yeah this it's is like a guy on like a little burrow like shark. Burrow okay. Shark. okay. It's like just a guy. Just well, like basically, it's like a sand shark with legs. Yeah. Sucks to suck. And all of these were formed out of the same. Does a 17 hit you? It does. It does hit me. Is that with the plus one from yeah. Sentinel? It is. Oof. Yes. First point of damage is going to do eight to you. Okay, I will be taking that. Next attack. Uh, 22. Uh, well, also hit. My health is wrong. Yeah. In, what is your health? It's 48. Yeah, it says 48. And now I just lost 8, so it's 40, and then whatever is going to happen yeah, next. Whatever, so 48, so and then you just it. took uh, plus 7 more points of damage, so that would be yeah. 33? Yes, 33 yeah, at the current. Thank you. Step. Awesome. And then finally, the last attack. Ooh, Oof. actually, this one will probably miss you with uh, 14. That is going to miss. All right, that will miss. Darby, you're next. Uh, Darby will go 10, 20, 30. And he will hawk a card at the Duragar. Oh, hawk that card. Oh, hawk that card. Oh, first card. You know, I played a lot of Skyrim, and I had no idea that's how you pronounced it. Duragar? Yeah. Uh, that's a 25 to hit. Yup. 10 four damage. Dark dwarf. It takes yeah. 10 force damage. And we'll throw a second. A yeah, Draugr. Throw a second. Yeah, no, there, I, I always called it Draugr until I heard people actually call it Durogar, and I was like, oh. It's like, it's like how, how I thought it. Epitome was Epitome. Yeah. Uh, 26 <laughs> That's okay, I thought, I thought Macabre was Macrave. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know, I always thought it was Colonel. I like Macrobay better. But Macrobay. Colonel's also. Isn't Macrobay like an actual building. term, too? Yeah, it's like some yeah, sort yeah, of. Yeah, Macrobay is like a, a, a type of art. Like yeah. Like a macrame finish or a macrame. Okay. Yeah. Macrame is art. Cool. Uh, 26 on the second hit. That's two hit, hit for uh, seven four stamps. It is still alive, but not looking hot. What else for you, Darby? Uh, bonus action. Spades can attack, but probably won't. Uh, bouncer All right, gets to your go. Uh, bouncers, your yeah. bouncers. Oh yeah, your bouncer gets to go. Yeah, bouncer Excuse gets me. to go first. He's gonna follow up on those cards, do a big old turn around Shuriyuken onto the the Durgar. Okay. Uh, for a fifteen to hit. That will miss. It bounces off his armor. Yeah. Hey. He's gonna go for the follow up kick. Okay. Uh, that is a dirty twenty. 
That'll hit. For max damage, 20 cold. The giant tour guard drops the sand. Hey. Ooh, uh, I get to add sand. something in here as well. Uh, the only one not made to sand is this guy. Uh, so am I looking at these people, and are they, like, bleeding? Are they constructs, nope. or are they... They, sand. Are, they, they are, are made of sand and i, I they would... look like people they are they are they they look like normal but as they're dying they just revert to their sand forms yeah, okay I, so I, just, okay cool that's that's, this, that's what i one, needed to know is this one bleeding sand or is he bleeding normally sand nice uh, all okay sand. good well then we're back we're back all right we're well, back in it. Goblins yeah, the bouncer was attacking the bouncer yep. she was like i can kill uh, sand people 18 <laughs> uh that is one over it is something I have to think about before I wake up. I, I, I hear you. Later. I hear you. You did take a note, so. Seven. Eight. Fifteen damage. Hmm. He's still up. Would the, would the people who got hit by the Molotov cocktail begin to turn to glass then? <laughs> no, but they are about, but they are taking damage. Yeah, they do take damage at the start of their turns. It'd be pretty dope if they just started to like fire. crystallize. <laughs> oh, he takes ten damage. He takes max on that. Yeah, <laughs> baby. He got it like right in his face. Like, yeah, <laughs> it exploded and on it his face. <laughs> Doctor Watts, you're next. Okay, I am going to hook up my cool ass dagger. Uh, to my nanotoxin, and I am gonna uh, stab at the sand guy. Go ahead. With uh, a booming of sorts booming blade. Yeah. And a boom. A booming of sorts blade. Yes. Boom. Here comes so, the uh, boom. Boom. So let's see. Let's see boom. how I do this. Boom. Booming blade. I attack with like just like my regular attack. Yeah, you're your attack. That is a seventeen. Ooh. Uh, let me double check that. Let me double check that. That will miss. It bounces off its armor. Ooh. Dang. Very okay, close. well then I'm gonna go... Uh... Oops, stop. Let's see. A uh, uh, 10... 20... 30... It will op. It can try. Because I have it will mobile. Try. And I attack uh, Okay, it. mobile. Thank yep. you. I forgot yep. about that. And I am going to go here, and then I'm going to go, actually, yeah, I did 10, 20, 30, but I'd leave this guy's threatened square. Yeah, if you were to move again. And you have not hit him. But yeah, well, he would I'm have gonna... disadvantage, because he's panached. He is panached. Yeah, you know. But starting your turn next to the bouncer also reduces your movement by. 10. Oh yeah, doesn't it? Because okay. I don't get I'm to pick what it reduces yeah. other than myself. And I'll go ten, twenty. Okay. And then as a bonus action, I shall drink one of the healing potions that we okay. have. The regular. Sounds good. Mm -hmm. okay. You may heal yourself then. All right, 2d4 plus 2. And we are looking at a whopping 5. Better than nothing. Better than nothing. I'll take it. What else for you, Jamie? That's it. All right, the next uh, guy is going to be on fire. He takes 4 damage. You know, he's not. He's he's feeling okay. He's going to chuck a javelin at uh, at Ruma. Oh. No, he's not. He can try. He will with a natural 20. Oh, dang. Yeah, that plus one AC don't matter. I ain't scared. He's... I ain't scared of no ghosts. And it's just a single javelin. It can't be that dangerous. Yeah, it's really not that bad. Yeah. That is going to be a big whopping seven damage. Whoa! That's do a I nasty power damage. play this guy? No, I'm not. No. I was going to do something really dumb. But Bones and <laughs> <laughs> just, just So you don't care. <laughs> I take no damage. All right. Darby, your bouncer is getting attacked at disadvantage. Yep. Does a... This is, I'm just asking because this is what I rolled. Does a 16 hit him? That is one below. It does not hit. Then I will not roll for the next one. He misses. Sentinel, you're next. All righty. Well then, so go here, 
Um... I'll go here. Okay. And then I'll hit this guy twice. You, you cannot attack him through the, the pillar does block it. So you the you attack oh. Sentinel from that yeah. guy. He threw I'm a javelin trying. at him from there. Good point. You may attack him. <laughs> I wasn't uh, allowing people to move through there, so yes, but if he was throwing a javelin, you would be able to hit him yeah. with your axe, so you may hit him. There's not enough space to walk, but there is enough right, to, but you to can, get weapons. Enough to throw or swing. Nope, yeah. I 100% he can do the, He can do the here's Johnny with his face. Here's yeah. Johnny! Here's <laughs> and now, we all here's know that Chicky. sand. Sand is another form of wood, correct? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know about that It's the wood of the desert. <laughs> it's the wood it's of the, the desert. Wood of the desert. The wood of the wood oh of that, no, it's the dirt of the desert. <laughs> I hate sand. It's and is it dirt it's everywhere. everywhere? Of the ground. <laughs> a toy six and a toy seven to hit. Yeah, both of those. I, I would agree that shit. a cactus is a tree of the desert. There's that one. There's literally trees and there's in the desert. Two. I know. <laughs> wood is the wood of, of the, the desert. desert. <laughs> Unprecedented concept. I know it's crazy. No. No, no, 19 like damage. <laughs> he did. 19 damage. It is still alive. Ooh, dang it. All right. Bummer. What else were you, Sentinel? You're doing a good that, job. That is it. All right, we got some more damage going to one of our guys. Oh, there's only going to be three, so he's going to stand his ground and huck another javelin. And there are two targets here, so we're going to do a 50 50. Evens or odds, Jamie? I'm going to say evens. That means you're taking the javelin. I'll take the javelin. Oh. That's can okay. You're not going to take a javelin because javelin. That's, a, that's an eight. Yeah. Can I yeah. dramatically catch it before it hits Jamie? It's on it'll fire, then, so. <laughs> it'll then move. All right. Darby, you're familiar who's done nothing this entire battle may go. Whoa. Um, he wow. allowed Ruma to throw <laughs> the Molotov cocktail into the hole. Thank it's you very true. much. True. Without that help true. action, he wouldn't have done it. He would have failed horribly. Yep. He and hit I probably would have hit into us. the thing. <laughs> yeah, he probably would have blown it up <laughs> on us. That would have been even worse. <laughs> Set himself on fire. Uh, he Pele kicked it into the, yeah. the slit. Uh, Spades will give myself the help action and mm. then flutter to the other side, and that'll be it. I just picture Spades in this battle is coming up and massaging people's shoulders and whispering, mm. you can do it in their ear. He's I sprinkling bet Spade like fairy dust on it. Spade means his else. best friend, Sebastian. <laughs> Any, else for spades? Uh, spade, honestly, Spade's doing the help action is basically just the stand hey yeah from JoJo's. Mm -hmm. Just a little dude that's just on your shoulder like, hey man, you can do it, I believe in you, you got it. And that's the only power it has. It just, it tells you really, it just it's tells TN. you things that it's are nice. Chow 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 Chow. Uh, that'll be it Chow for Spade. That's right Thank you. All right, yeah, Sentinel, Chow. you're getting attacked by the you boy got these, that attack. I'm going to blow myself boy. up now, bye. <laughs> Chow, big. No. He's big and enlarged. He's going for the war pick. Ooh. Yeah, no, that's a 10. Oh, Ruma, he, tried. Next. he tried, he tried. All right, all right. All right. This Komodo dragon looking mother trucker is here. He, he is. Yep, he, he is. is there. He is there. That is correct. Do be true. Oh, just hi, butter Kat. you guys up for my enemy at the end of this to hits for a plus 17. So it's all oh, good. Yeah, that's it. I love it. That's what I want. Yeah, just roughing us up so that the, Give it to me. Yeah, the, the creature that can only roll nat 20s at the end of the dungeon can just really it's rock us. Yeah. yeah. If it rolls, right, gonna... it, it crits on anything but a nat one. So <laughs> I'm going to smack it around a little bit. And then bit a nat one's a 18. double crit. Yeah. <laughs> no, nat one's just a An normal 18? hit. It has a plus 30 yeah. and can't critically fail. Beats it, beats it, buddy. Hey. <gasps> A, wow, seven crushing damage. Did, did you? Is it getting pushed back? It is. That mine as well. It chooses not to because it can do that. Oh, oh damn! He is stopping oh, right. your ability. You go to crush it and it just with, withstands it. it well, not if I go and crush it again. Harder. I want one of those. Never mind, I missed. It was 13 to hit, so... Uh, yeah, that definitely missed. Yeah, what else were you there? So, right? so you certainly try. You know, you gave me well, the best. Well, you know what? I didn't think I was gonna, but I'm gonna bonus action cast Shield of Faith on myself. So now I have an effective... Uh, 
a 24 AC. Oh my god! Yeah, that that sentinel bonus is huge right now. Yeah. All it's right, Azrael, you're next. After fleeing and putting your healer in harm's way, what will you do? Whoa! Wow. <laughs> Jamie can isn't helpless. Jamie, yeah, can I'm just letting helpless. you guys know that that was correct. He also has half your total hit points. Yeah, Whose yeah, choice so. was so, that though? Whose choose choice was that? Also true. Also true. Whose choice? This is how my character just is. You made, you made that character. <laughs> That's he, true. Can't, he, he can't help random dice rolls though. He could have rolled a lot of ones. I could have rolled badly. What the hell is that my fault? I'm just. I'm working with what I got. <laughs> I move ten feet. Attack with a scimitar. That's gonna yep. be a uh, non-natural twenty to hit. It. Ooh. Yuppers. That's sneak Love attack, to see baby. It. Sneak attack two ways. He's a big damn Dimaggio here. Dimaggio. Twenty-nine damage. Ooh. That was what you did last time. It takes 29 damage. Still alive, Man. though. I'm going to hit it again. Hit it again. Uh, hit it two more 24 times. 24 to hit. That will definitely hit. Okay, and this time with just... No sneak attack. Five damage. That's pretty good, though. It takes five. Still alive, yeah, though. That's almost All your right. max hit. Um, your offhand. That's pretty good. Then I'm going to go... Went 10 already. Let's go 20, 30, and okay. uh, stay there. All right, that's, that's your turn. turn. That is action. He's going to He's going to, he's, he's butthurt. He's going to come at you with three attacks. That's First fine. attack is a miss. Second attack, that's probably also a miss. 17. That misses. Third attack, that is also a miss. Wow, Burrow Shark. Get right. a job. You can't do it. <laughs> Darby. <laughs> you. Uh, I will come up 10 feet, and I will chuck my first card at advantage at the Burrow Shop. Go ahead. Thanks for the help, actually. Uh, that is a dirty 20 to hit. Yuppers. For 12 force damage. The Burrow Shark turns to sand. Let's go. Oh, you kill Steeler. I did, like... Clean it up. I had 58 damage to that thing! <laughs> yeah, but you guys are in danger, so you know, it's it's fine. And you needed uh, more than yeah. that. I'm gonna check <laughs> out the, the bottom hobgoblin as well. For the second Go ahead. Uh, natural 20. Uh, yeah? Uh, yeah? That might hit. Yeah, just a little yeah, bit. That, that might do a little bit of damage when, when the... Oh, yeah, that might do a little bit damage. minimum damage. <laughs> uh, one off of max crit damage. Uh... Oof. That's 24 force damage. <laughs> that yeah. that's a sandy hobgoblin. Yeah, that was a that was a nine and a ten. That was then my next guy to go <laughs> to. What else for you, Darby? Uh, I will back up ten feet, and then uh, it is the bouncer's turn. The bouncer. The, the Which, bouncer. Uh, D camp switch bouncer. Yeah, that'll work. Spencer does have 40 feet of movement. He will go 10, 20, 30, 40, and take the opportunity. He won't at... go out of range of the yep. Hobgoblin for an hour. At disadvantage, at disadvantage but that is fine. Though. Yep. Okay. 17. That meets it, beats it. At disadvantage, Dean. Yeah. Ethan. I rolled a... I, You're good, man. I no, rolled a... What's I believe it. Your, roll, your rolls are always good. True. Uh, that is going to be a five. Yeah, it was a very unlikely to do a super amount. Uh, and a bouncer will punch the Durogar. Go ahead. Draugr. Uh First hit is a 24. Yuppers. That is 18 Yo. cold on the first punch. Yo, he oh, he's dead. Darby nice. just added to his kill count. Yeah, no, I'm just starting up this round. Saved us. Oh. Yeah, I initiated it, and I am here to keep going. You uh, played Pot of Greed. That allows him to draw two cards. Yeah, that allows me to draw two additional cards right. from the top of my deck. Yeah. I've been a fake pot of uh, green. Uh, <laughs> that lets me draw two cards and from then the top of my deck. I will play uh, pot of, of green. green. This card lets me draw two cards from the top of my deck. I will now this play pot of works. green. Yes, it is, because I played pot, pot of green. green. <laughs> uh, uh, so sorry, Arthur, oh, I guess. I don't God. know where the other Duragars are, and I'm out of movement. Shadow Kaiba plays pot of green. So I will swing at the uh, the hobgoblin for the second punch. 
Go Screw ahead. the rules. I have money. I will break my ass. Screw the rules. I have blue hair. Uh, Fifteen to hit. That will miss. Oh. Unfortunately, Ooh. that was a full twelve on the deep level. Alternatively, there. could Darby see around this corner? Uh, I cannot see from the senses of yeah. my oh, bouncer. Okay. The bouncer can like Anything he has his own like he's got 120 dark vision. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah, he I also guess you could technically he can't move, move any further. That was all forty of his movement, so he's stuck right there. Ah, Are you all set, then, Darby? Yeah, that is it for me and the bouncer. He's right. bouncer. But he's also he's blocking the way at least. Anything. So he's also gonna attack your bouncer. Yes. Oh wait, the guy's back? No, oh, it's a different it's another guy. One. Yeah. A different guy. Oh, I, I, I missed that. that. Sorry. Yeah, there was like four or five of them Here total. It's there's one. Uh, of those... non natural twenty. Yeah, that hits. There's one of those like thing or, like blobs in the corner that just keeps spawning them. Yeah, we have we have to destroy like the blob six. before they stop spawning. You take six damage. Easy, easy. Dr. He's Watch still up. He's D Kips is looking really bad. The flames are the the shadow flames are starting to flicker a little bit, but he is D he's Kips still is here. Dead. Oh no, D Kips One is the bouncer. Dare and then I'm gonna attack this dude. Go ahead. I mean, with the same uh, thing as before, because okay. what else I should do? Which uh, Panache okay. is and over at this point, I believe. Is it just when we attack? 17 again! My goodness. That will miss, unfortunately, Jamie. I think... Um, what is Because I think this? it's when we attack it, not when we damage it, right? Yeah, it's when All we right. always engages it. So yeah, yep. Panache is gone now. Yep. Well then, okay. I will go... To... How... 10, 20, 30... 40 bonus action dash 50 60. Okay. And because you are there, Dr. Watts, I will give you a little more view of the dungeon. Well, yeah. you can see a hallway and a hallway. I love it. Anything else for Always you? Never. Um, no nope. I will not. I'm ready to go. All right, more damage to our buddy still on the fire and the flames. Six more. Oh yeah, the one that's <laughs> chilling over there. He's gonna, he's gonna an shoot expert at, mode. He's gonna shoot yeah. it at, uh, at Ruma. He's gonna shoot at Ruma. Understandable. He's gonna Ruma. Try to shoot it. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> what is your? It's a twenty-four. He's at yeah. twenty-four right now. <laughs> It physically, unless I roll a net 20, cannot hit you the high. I rolled a 19, it did a 23. It cannot hit you. <laughs> oh, just barely. Yeah, that plus one from Sentinel uh, was the only reason that didn't hit. All right, we love that. We I love that. Yeah, if Sentinel love was right one here. space oh. away from you, you would have gotten hit there. Going for your bouncer, Darby. <laughs> okay, he could he try. He misses your bouncer, Darby. Sentinel, you're Sentinel. next. Well, he tried. Yeah, All righty. Here we go. Save them. Beat up the new Save Bandit. Save Bandit. Save Bandit. Save bandit. Uh, so here we go. Gonna hit him again. You're gonna wreck it. Gonna wreck, wreck it. Ralph. I'm gonna wreck it, Ralph. First one is a net twenty. Hey, yeah, that hits. That always. That's hits. what we wanted the whole time. Yeah. That's always what we wanted. Should I roll again? Yeah. Uh, go ahead and see what the damage will do first, because you might yeah. kill it. Okay. Because you get you get three D twelve from your yeah, he's gonna do brutal a critical. Lot of damage here. Unless he rolls those Nick classic ones. Yeah, those classic yeah. the the classic, <laughs> the classic Nick damage. crit of seven damage. <laughs> the Nick crit. The Nick crit. Nick crit. Hits a normal damage roll of like twenty, but crits for seven. That's the classic. Okay, D &D. so the fir first one is fourteen damage. It is still on its feet. Oof. Then the second. Well, it's, so it's D, 2 D12, so 14. You get an additional one as well for your Brutal Critical. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So then another, so that's 20. This is for one attack. 23 damage, yeah. Yeah, it is super dead. It turns to sand. On the first All right. Oh, nice crit. We're here for this. Yeah. We are here for this. All right, then I'm gonna come down here. Darby died yep. for this, and I for the second die. one. Darby didn't die. For what are you talking about? Guys, oh, just <laughs> wait. Twenty-one to hit. That'll hit. Yeah, just wait seven sessions, then Darby dies. <laughs> and I bring in my new character, Johnson McJohnson. I just once. 
a family company. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so that is. He's the CEO plus. of Johnson Incorporated. <laughs> He doesn't have a class. Uh, He's just a level seven human. That's it. So four, fourteen <laughs> damage. Level seven business what have they man. Done to my boy. Ooh, more sand. Look at him go. Ooh. That sentinel second. Hunt. Did it. What else? We won. Uh, that is. Detect. I don't have a bonus action to do anything, so I'm good. Hey. All right, next one's gonna go. Oh, he's coming out. It's more. Sentinel, I gotta get a hit off you at some point here. Hit me. Oh, right. actually, he might. 21? Yeah, that's yeah. me my wall, too. <laughs> yeah, even with the plus one. I'll that is one. going to be six points of damage. Yeah. Does that Ooh, have? You just have me. your rage, so three. Nice. Yeah. Darby, you're familiar, Miguel. Uh, what's the fly speed on spades? It's, like, kind of fast. Oh, it's 60 feet. Let me, let me, let me see. Square. Oh, that is that is just enough. He is a tiny creature. Let him occupy the same spot. I think you can all kind of occupy the same yeah. spots. Uh, for sake of clarity, I will put him next to Sentinel just so that we know. But he's okay. he's sharing Sentinel space, uh, and he That's will fine. he will attack the Duogar with a sting. Go ahead. He's embedded Go ahead. himself. This in is the poison floor. damage, right? Uh, it does piercing damage that is magical for the purpose of overcoming resistance, but if it hits, okay. he has to make a con save or be hit with the poisoned condition or fall unconscious, depending on how hard he fails. There we go. All right. Oh, there goes my D4. Uh, that is plus four to hit. That is an 18. That'll hit. Uh, I don't know where. Oh, going. yeah. Oh, I don't think he'll find it. Uh, he needs to make a constitution saving throw of 11. And he will take 12. four piercing damage. Wow, he beats it by one. That's unfortunate. He and beat it by one. Takes four <laughs> piercing damage. Four magical piercing damage. He took four magical piercing. Anything else for the you? The most spades? magical piercing. That is it for spades. Where did that be from? All right, so I, I just got it. thrown a javelin from this direction over here. Uh, Probably dead. Is he dead? I don't remember which one did it to you, but it's probably dead. <laughs> well, I'm Who assuming knows? there's nobody over there. <laughs> I mean, that's like the third or fourth one to come out from that door. So. Well, like I said, wow. there's like one of those oh. things we gotta smash before they stop coming. What do we have to smash? A spawner? Minecraft spawner? Yeah, we gotta we gotta break yep. them. We gotta put a bunch of torches around games. before the. We gotta go, you know. go around the corner and smash the spawn thing. Yeah, yeah, the okay. giant spawn egg that keeps spitting out Duragar every like you know every two rounds. I'm gonna hit the drug dealer twice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the drug drug dealer. Where is my money? Where's my money? So, where's my, where's my fucking money, Denny? The first one's gonna do 13 crushing damage. What did you wow. hit him for? Oh, sorry. I assumed yeah. it passed. It was a 28 to hit. <laughs> yeah, okay, that does yeah. pass. <laughs> I also got a 28 to hit I'm... again. Kill you. Yeah, both yeah, of them. That's, the that's fair. The first damage. Hold on. Good thing D and D yeah, beyond this little tell you chat you. function. Uh, thirteen damage on the first one, and, and second. eight damage on the second. That's some sand, baby. Yeah, sand, sand nice. baby. We got the sand. Oh, also, I I should have done this. You guys can see into the screen. Oh, we can see the I tootsies. I see a toe. Yeah, we see the all. tootsies. <laughs> He's Get just sitting there. <laughs> Beat him up. Fuck him. Uh, um, <laughs> wait, where was I? I was here. Uh, Where's that? Okay, that's my full movement. That's my action. I, mean, I don't feel like using a spell to misty step. So yeah. <laughs> all right, Asriel, misty you're step active. right next to him. What up, bro? And I can't even 30. hit you, but I'm here. And dash, hey. 10, 20, 30. He's right there. I'm gonna smoke what this else guy for Yasriel? with a scimitar. But I, even though I can't Darby. see him. Wait, wait, whoa. What? He can bonus action move. dash. Oh. I would I would like to smoke this guy with the scimitar. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You get to bonus he, action. He is a rogue. He <laughs> is a like, rogue. Right, Darby, I, yeah. I want to hit this guy. Yeah. 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 You still, yeah. still have an attack. You, you don't want to do that. I was testing you. He can rogue. You, you Go ahead. Give don't me a get to. You're not a last Zero. Oh, that's not going to be very good. Uh, that's going to be a 15 to hit. Oh. He whips out his weenie and wags it in your face. <laughs> All right, so it didn't oh, matter. We wow. could have just skipped you. That's okay. fine. 
Wow. wow. <laughs> this is a savage session. What else for you, Um, I'm Darby. going to shoot Darby. <laughs> I'm going to use Take my again. second I'm bonus action. Point. I'm going to shoot Darby through the wall. All right, Darby. Okay. You uh, are next. Action, action. Bonus action. Movement. I don't think you can get to him. I mean, your uh, bouncer can. But... I'll, I'll go. No, I can't. I, unless I could somehow see him through the wall, no. Uh, I'll go, I'll go here. I guess I'll action dash. And I'll just okay. kind of run over here to this little corner. Uh, and okay. then I will command the bouncer to start swinging. Bounce. I'll, go, uh, Bounce. he'll run his way over here. I will refuse to allow the bouncer to walk through my space. <laughs> he can punch oh, wow. it from the corner. No. Agile serves as a bouncer to the bouncer. Anyways, give me a attack. He will go for now. the first punch. The <laughs> left hook is a dirty 20. <laughs> Yeah, that'll hit. It's 18 cold. Uh, okay. it turns to sand! Whoa! Clean it up! So much Come on, computer, you can do it. You need to select the Duogar so you can delete him. Oh, I'm in the wrong mode. That's why I can't select him. Wrong He's mode. He's dead. Congratulations, you've solved my Duogar puzzle. Wow. <laughs> Which is just him behind the thing. Wait, the that is... Up. That is that is the room. Give me five seconds. I have drank way too much water and I have to pee like a racehorse. I will be back shortly. He's got a race like a piss. Do not go away. We, oh, I will literally be back in five seconds. The end of the session, guys. All right, we did it. Bye, I everybody. Prove, I will prove to everyone why they call me the Flash. Good night, Good night everyone. That was it. Me? Wait, wait. Do you we guys should, call him the Flash? We should no. all we should all no drop off a there. Discord right now just to see what <laughs> just just Ethan does when he comes back. That's the end of that. Thank or you everyone just... for coming by. You can check out the VODs, exclamation point VODs, 12 p.m. EST next day always. No. We can always just like <laughs> gaslight him into thinking it's been like a really long time. Yeah, it's, it's actually it's midnight right now. Years. It's been 80 years. <laughs> What are you talking? D and D? We haven't been playing D and D since two thousand. You know what we all should do? We should all. We come back on this Discord every year on the anniversary of your disappearance. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody, copy and paste a whole bunch of tokens of yourself on the map. Go, 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 go. go. <laughs> Duplicate. <laughs> Nick's back, guys. I'm back. Oh, hey, I peed. I peed faster than the Ethan. <laughs> and the Flash. Yeah. I am flashier. Flash. You are the reverse Flash. Mega flash. Yeah. I was wondering if the reason they call him Flash is because he kidnaps people. Oh. Wow. 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 Oof. Oof. All about the head pressure, Oof. baby. Let's go. Oof. <laughs> Ethan, I was I was making the joke that I was wondering if people call you the Flash because you kidnap people. Also possible. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't like Big it. Oof. Oof. Big oof. A lot of low blows here. So, <laughs> Azrael, you stepped into this the side room with the the bouncer. With the bouncer. Uh, so there's some the trouble with masonry in this old guard room uh, that illustrates the great age of this palace. To the north, a long gallery leads to the arrow slits in the western wall. To the south, a pile of rubber chokes a small inner chamber. Half a dozen plain bedrolls and an iron stove furnish this room. A pile of firewood nearby keeps the stove well stocked, or at least it did at one time. <laughs> Does it appear like there's anything interesting? Oh, well, I guess if we're in an invest investigation, can I check to see if there might be any secret passages off this room or anything of interest in here? Yes, give me a perception. Also, uh, the Molotov cocktail still burns in the upper. Yeah, there. I figured that's what that was. Thank you. No. Yeah. But yes, go ahead, give me a perception. Perception 19. There is nothing of secret or of note in here besides okay. some firewood and bed rolls. All right. All right. So technically, in our next order, so it would be you, Sentinel. Yes. All righty. Would you like to go to the left or to the bottom hallway? Because those are the only hallways. Oh, so I don't. I don't have this aura anymore. And the bouncer's up for a total of one hour. I believe. I'm pretty sure it's one. Yeah, he'll probably be with you for a while. Yeah, probably. I mean, he's he's not looking great, but <laughs> he's still here. Yeah, right. until he died. One hour. He'll, he'll probably drop before the hour comes through. Let's Sitting check there. this way. All 
right, Sentinel, he's going so east. I always go east. There's more east. That's a big looking thing. Sentinel. Well, actually, if you want to stop right here. This is where you die. <laughs> yes, you must give me a dexterity saving throw. Because you've stumbled upon more sand beans. Oh, no. You have a large, no. large suite consists of several small rooms linked by a low archway. Brown curtains offer some sort of privacy for the different rooms, and a martial display covers the wall. Seals and cross swords, tattered banners, and few mounted monster heads, including those of a periton and a manacore. However, you're more interested in all the sand people. <gasps> sand yeah. people. You guys will have to give me another initiative roll. Dang, just one combat right into the next. Whew. It's a good thing the no Bouncer breaks. has 40 feet of movement. And it's a I good thing you guys it. didn't tell me you didn't want more combat in your game. Yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> uh, okay, what is my... I got, I got a 17. Okay. 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 I will keep okay. typing. Keep typing. <laughs> quick, quick. And the familiar... <laughs> An 18. Wow, that that's unfortunate. When the familiar goes before the caster, that's a feel bad. That's how you know life sucks. Oh, Means I can't have him attack immediately. Not that I would really want him to attack that much anyway. <laughs> he does not have a good to hit bonus. When you accidentally close out of one of your monsters, not the one you needed, but when you accidentally close out of one, you know you'll have to open them later. I have to happen all the time. That's a recurring problem for me. I constantly close out of my monsters. I rolled like a dookie. Uh, Dr. Watts, you definitely, uh, both of you are definitely going before this cultist. He is not uh, very good at his. I assume you probably have a higher dex than me, but I, I don't know if we're able to choose our time. I don't remember how that works. Yeah, it, it depends on whose dex is higher or. <laughs> Uh, if you tied, you can choose who wants to go first. Uh, Dr. Watson, Darby, what are your dexes? I have a 18. You are muted, Dr. Can Daniel I, Lee Watts. You are muted there. Oh, 16, sorry. 16. Oh, wow, I'm actually faster than you. Why, right, Darby actually will go first yeah, then. Wow, that's or before you. So, ironically, this one cultist rolled better than everyone else, and he's going to go 10, 20, 30, and he's going to take a thwack at you, Sentinel. No, Sentinel. There he is. <laughs> if this hits, I'm gonna laugh. Oh my god, does a not natural 20 hit you? Yes, it does. <laughs> uh, that is six damage. And Sentinel, because you went right into combat, I will say you have not lost your rage yet. Oh, okay. So, was that damage so you already have? Great. Oh. If, if you had made it past your exploration, you would have lost it, but the fact that you just walked right into more combat, yeah. you still got it. So you can get your aura back if you like. There you go. Okay. Can everyone see that? Or do you need to yep. re-enact no, it? Sweet. That was his turn. Sentinel, you're next. Well, then I'll hit him right back. Yeah. Right. Oh, Give him a slappy da. That jerk? Slap, slap dick him. Oh, my God. 21 to hit. That'll hit. I mean, you what you is happening? <laughs> and an 18. Oh, God, yeah, you just obliterate the Sandman into nothing. <laughs> With just one hit? That's yeah, a yeah. sand person, too? Okay. Yeah, yep. more sand people. So then Who I'm going to hit this guy. Ooh, the big, the big tanky armor, man. What did you say, Jamie? Go. They said they have beds. Yeah. So they're that big. Were used at, <laughs> that were used at one point. Yeah. Go ahead, give me an attack set. So maybe it's an 18 to hit. Here, and then the sand is like reforming. Meets it, beats it. Like. Yeah, they're like and reincarnations then... made out of this sand. Is, oh. so is, that's uh, my assumption. Arcan territory, it could be... Yeah, it could be anything. But they're like not that is any living being. 10 damage. Nine. He takes 10 damage, uh, but he's still on his feet. Sand armor. That's it for me. <laughs> Darby's familiar spades, you're next. Yeah, spades gets to go. Spades will uh sprinkle some magical dust onto Ruma and make Ruma feel lucky and give him the help action. 
Yeah, we'll just sit there. That is, that is it for spade. Darby. Odd. Uh, 10, 20, 30. And then I guess I'll dash and go 10, 20, 30. Okay. That'll be a uh, bonus what? action. Uh, Bouncer does go. Oh, no, Bouncer. Too. Bouncer. And bonus bouncer. action, spade's going to attack. Not that he will. Uh, bouncer is going to go 10, 20, 30, 40. Dash. 10, 20, 30, 40, and try to stay a little out of the way. Okay. But making his way downtown, walking fast. Now, Dr. Watts, you may go. Making sure he's okay. not Okay, Dr. Watts is going to go all the way there with a movement and a bonus action to dash. And then, can I see uh, these beings? Yeah. Uh, this, one sec, let me see. Look here. There is a wall here, yeah. There is a wall there, so the okay. there's a wall. these two down oh, here you can't. Yeah. This one you can't, but this one and this one I will say oh, you can't see me clicking at them. These guys right here, but those okay. two can't see. And um they look similar to the other sand yep. beings from before. Yep, they cool. they look like they're real, but they turn to sand when they die. Okay. Well then in that pile of sand in front of sand. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, I'm just okay. standing on top of a small pile of sand. Then so I am going to... Actually, you know, I don't really have any long-range stuff right now that I want to waste. So, I will I want to waste. use the help action <gasps> on Sentinel so he doesn't have to Reckless next time. That's very nice. And that'll be the end of my turn. Alright, one of the sand cultists is gonna go. He's gonna go 10, 20, 30. Does he have a ranged attack? He doesn't. So he's going to dash and stand next to you, Sentinel. Azrael, you're next. Alright, Azrael's gonna do the hokey pokey. He's gonna go 10, 20, 30, dash, 10, 20, 30, action, 10, 20, 30. Turns over. Cool. Next one. Hell yeah. 10, 20, 30, standing on one of the beds. It's attacking you, Sentinel. Okay. Oh, no. You can't stand on top of the bed. That's 11. dangerous. That's a miss. You That's could fall off and break your head open, Mr. Sand Cultist. No more monkeys right, jumping on the bed. No more Burrow sand shark is jumping go. on the bed. And it's going to go there because this area is a little too Very tiny. Yeah. Yeah. Fireball. Occupy the same spot. Turn him to glass. Oh, you're next. I mean, fireball does go around walls. That would be devastating. That's a very tiny room. <laughs> Literally You're just hit everything. everything. <laughs> I forgot that I have a book called The Unholy Book of Recipes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot yeah, that's how, that. uh, you do. That's how yeah. Otis Much summoned the yeah. undead pirates. Yeah, we found that in his, uh, his safe. I was just looking at the stuff. He made like brownies or something, didn't he? Didn't he? Like, yeah, like, I don't remember brownies what he made. You guys were gonna make a recipe out of it. And I warned you not to. Sentinel was gonna make one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Gonna put a chef's Sentinel head was like, like oh, there's more recipe. You could cook some good food than mine. Like... No. All right. What is the structural integrity of these walls? You want to bust through the wall? I'm Give me an attack so roll. slow. <laughs> Yeah, right, you're gonna be real slow right. if you stand next to the bouncer on your dirty uh, twenty. Why am I having you attack the wall when it's a wall? I'm sorry. Give me damage. Okay. I guess if you roll the nat twenty, yeah. you do crit damage on it. So yeah. that's why. Yeah. You go for it. That's why you attack. You critically one, strike. Unless wall. you roll a one and then you just yeah. biff the wall. Yeah. But <laughs> somehow miss. You, you, you crushing damage. I would like to remind you that walls are vulnerable to crush. Probably yeah. push it. Push it 10 feet. <laughs> push the wall 10 feet. Yeah, I'm pushing the wall. The wall's not a creature, okay, unfortunately. I'm going to give it to you. I wasn't going to destroy the wall, but the fact that you could push it 10 feet, the wall cannot structurally be sound to be pushed. You bust through the wall. There is now a room sized hole for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's going to be my whole turn. Oh, yeah. That's your turn? Yep. All right. Well, that gave you they give options for some other guys. Who's gonna go 10, yeah. 20, 30, and attack and attack you, Ruma? That's exactly how that should have gone down. Yeah. <laughs> well, it stops Sentinel from getting pounded. 
I, I don't think it's going to matter. I this think guy, that fiddle's fine. Again, rolling a 19 is a 22. That would meet it, because you're not in Sentinel's Aura. Oh, yeah, aura. I got, no, I have I have a 23 without Sentinel's Aura. Oh, you have 23 without it? Oh, that's yes. right, yeah. I have Shield yeah, of Faith failed. going. I never yeah, I lost forgot. concentration for no, 10 I know. minutes. I, for, I forgot if you had 22 failed. with or without. Or with <laughs> God. It. All right, Sent Sentinel, you're good. I love all these, like, little enemies they put in this dungeon to, like, overwhelm yeah. you guys. It just doesn't matter. <laughs> all right, this guy's going to, this black, black Earth Guard Sandman is going to attack you twice, Sentinel. Ooh. Okay. He's spooky. Nope. nope. Okay, and cool. double nope. That was a five and a nine I rolled. Sentinel, you're next. Nice. Uh, you did give us pause when everyone started taking defensive stances, though, I will say. I yeah, was like, why are they being defensive? Here. And then we ran in there and found out that they're not that scary. <laughs> well, no, no, we didn't run through in there. You're the arrows. That's true, yeah. You guys ran in there. I like having javelins first. Yeah. <laughs> You guys did exactly what they wanted to. You ran in and let the Duogar use their the yeah. reaction shots on yeah. you guys, but right. it just doesn't matter. And by you guys, you mean Arthur and only Arthur, because he's the only one that went in yep. there. Yeah. <laughs> I got in there, and <laughs> I got the job. Right, you did too, but you did too. Jamie got hit too. Jamie got hit too. They tried to hit me, but. Yeah, yeah they can't. <laughs> All right. Uh, they're not, they're not good. Know, what are you doing with your two right. uh, I'm hitting at uh, 17. The monkey on the bed. Give me, give me DiMaggio. Six damage. And he has the health three. action, Just so nine. he doesn't yes. have to be reckless. Yep. Okay, then I'm going for the other oh. one. What did I just hit? 21 to hit. That'll hit. Nice. Doing 13 damage. More sand, Sentinel. Well, it is coarse, and it does get everywhere. Oh. Yep. Is it in what my shorts? You, you don't have shorts, you're a chicken. My metaphorical shorts. It's in your case. Uh, it's in your yes. <laughs> yes. It's filled your giblets. <laughs> giblets. I'm done. Yeah, I'm done. Darby, you're it's familiar. It's my raccoon Ooh. wounds. <laughs> Might as well fly over here. Give Ruma the help action, and uh, uh, and and it. its turn. Nice, Darby. Hey. Uh, I'm assuming. I probably can't see any of them from here. You can, um, you know, I'll say you can see the burrow shark because you can kind of peer around him, Dr. Watts. All right, then I will throw some cards. I won't let him. I won't let him look past me. <laughs> I will throw cards at the Swipe We're just, like, <laughs> We're just not a cooperative party. No. no. Everyone's Jamie's in it for themselves. The, like, the whole like basketball defensive stance. Like, oh, yeah. yep. oh, you can't get it. No. <laughs> Uh, that is a 19 to hit on the first one. That'll hit. And force. It takes 10 force. And uh, that is an 18 on the second. Meets it, beats it. Or six oh. force. Minimum beats damage. It, baby. Takes six damage, still on its feet. Or uh, it's burrow shark, it's still late. Okay, uh, bonus action. Fates can attack. Them. I'm not one of those people. <laughs> uh, that's it for Darby the Bouncer. Uh, can... There's a now giant rumus sized hole next to this yeah, guy. I was about to him. ask, can the bouncer swing at this dude? He can. He can. Then he will. Uh, he'll he'll just go for the biggest boot kick you've ever seen. Uh, that is a 22 to hit. That'll hit the bouncer. Uh, biggest boot kick is an understatement. It's nine damage, or an overstatement is nine damage, nine cold. <laughs> It, it turns to sand. Dang, boot oh, kicks it and sends in. <laughs> uh, Bob's just doing work, 20, boys. 30, right, 10, 20, 30, 40. And he'll start. It's going again. He'll go for a punch on that guy after I add the cultist to the guy. And then he will punch the big armored dude. Okay. Uh, for a 21 to hit. Yuppers. Uh, seven plus eight is fifteen cold damage, I believe. Takes fifteen cold Band. damage. <laughs> Still on. Is he... Oh uh, damn it! And he that'll sucks. be that'll For be one it. time. On a one shark, time it was what? Well, he's gonna go ten, and he's gonna. He's not really a, an attacky kind of guy, but he's gonna keep trying. Apparently. You'll get it one of these times. Well, eventually. That's the 27. That's one That's of those times. One of these times. <laughs> yeah. But it was to now. It's right now. Yeah, it's, um, now so is the time. He's, he's going to deal 
I'm not, I don't have advantage though, so I don't get sneak attack. But I will. Uh, you do you get sneak attack because an ally, both Sentinel and yes. the uh, bouncer. bouncer is next. Who is an ally? Okay. Team. Well, or next to the enemy. I mean, not you. Yeah. But. Well, then it will take. Let me pull out my other dice. Six piercing damage or slashing damage is a dagger, and okay. then eight sneak like attack dagger. damage. I think a dagger ears is piercing, but it doesn't matter because he's sand. Haha! Uh, let's see him before any of the near, booming blade damage. I can watch toxic. runs in and gives him the old one two with the stab of the dagger and it turns into sand. And then Stabs um him right in the sand heart. That was an attack. As a bonus action. He's gonna do a little jig. And then he's gonna go back in. <laughs> a bonus action dances. <laughs> I don't. I, he doesn't. He doesn't need anything, so yeah. he's done. He was over there. Azrael. Ten, twenty, thirty. <laughs> ten, twenty, thirty, and he's gonna shoot this guy. I made shoot. a door. <laughs> Ruma made a door. Uh, oh, that's gonna be that. a nineteen to hit. That'll hit. You can't find a door. Make one. Not sneak attack though, as there's no allies in front. Yeah, of you don't have advantage on the hit either. That is correct. Um, that's gonna be seven uh, plus six, so thirteen. Ooh. He takes thirteen, 13 damage. damage. And that is magic. What else for you? It's the wood devil. Uh, that was action, bonus action, and, and uh, movement. Movement. We're good. <laughs> I'm gonna tap you, Sentinel. He's coming up for three attacks. That simmy. Hit me. A skimmy. That's gonna be a no for me, dog. One second. <laughs> That's 21. Me, What'd you say? 21. 21? 21. Yeah, that hit. That's gonna be six of three damage. And natural 20. We'll allow that. We'll that allow might that. hit. Yeah. Just barely. Right. The natural 20 misses. Yeah, the the natural 20 yeah. misses, though. Yeah. Uh, that's a 16 or 8 to you. I actually have I have a feat that says if an enemy uh, critically strikes me, I actually don't take any barbs. damage. You just need silvery barbs. Yeah, there you go. Alright. Um, one, two, three. Oh, Ruma's gonna grunt that he's getting too old for this shit, and then I'm gonna take the dash action to go there and look, look at it. I'm just gonna look at Stare it. Stare at it menacingly. That's okay, because Sentinel will, will do the slap Sentinel will you. probably murder it. I just wanted to get that 24 AC one more time. Yeah. That's fair. Just to feel it on yeah, my skin. Yeah, just, just to feel the power <laughs> again. You know. um, it's good. Oh yeah, 24 AC. Nobody can hit me. What you doing, Sentinel? Doing his best. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing my very darndest. Playing switch sports. Uh, I'm gonna hit this guy then. Hit him. In front of me. Why not? I might as well. Ooh. 25 Ooh. to hit. Yup. Yeah. But even better. And. Dead. Same. Nat 20. Yup. Yeah. That's he might be sanded, mate. That damage is. Oh. is it a real crit or is it a nick crit? It's That's a sandy cheek. <laughs> it's it's one of them is a one. Oh, yeah. Man. Yeah. Always oh, a one. Uh, so that is a uh, sixteen to hit on okay. one of them. You mean and then damage? Yeah, sixteen damage for damage, yeah. and then yeah. a thirteen to hit, uh, or thirteen damage for the other one. So it'll, it'll take most your from the nine damage in total. Yeah, I know. I got almost wow. as much damage on my regular hit D12s. as I did. You rolled 13 damage. Yep. That's, That's great. Wild. All right. It's still on its feet. What else? For you All right. Let me remove That's the it. one from your count. Hmm. That is it for right. me. Yep. Mr. Mr. Spades. Well, Miss your spades. Right he is a French. Spades will so flutter in. We <laughs> and we'll go to attack the shark. He'll attack the shark with his spade. Shark. With his delay stinger. With his speed. Oh, oh, oh. That is a natural two. Oh, That's oh. a 
That's a <laughs> so hit. Two. To hit. Oh, wee, wee. No, that will miss. That is a wee. Wee. Oh. on the die. You I did roll a natural oh. Uh Spade this has nothing up. That is all of his movement, and he has I no imagine Spade. Spade. Viva la revolucione! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> no, in fact, yes. he learned! Bring the fox back! <laughs> the fox, come back. He's a I dragon, not a fox, I swear! Spade's producing a top hat and a cane and just going, Hello, my darling, hello, oh, my baby. <laughs> <laughs> hello, my darling. Hello, my darling. Alright, darling, you are now. Time. Actually, uh, not your familiar. Someone who can actually do real. something. <laughs> oh. So familiar can give the help action, which is sometimes useful. But give we're it just to gonna me. start hawking cards. Yuck. Uh, that is an 18. Oh. Yup. Beats Ten fours. Take nope. 10 fours. Take 10 fours. Still on its feet. Oh, Man. Its Second card. Thing, this is a good thing. This thing isn't getting like bum rushed. Just like, yeah, it is surrounded by it, literally everything. <laughs> Uh, that's a natural one. That will definitely miss. It's okay. But it's the bouncer. The bouncer time. gets to come in. He's the gonna bouncer. crack his yeah, neck as he walks like, forward. Yeah, He's gonna the come in. He's gonna it. grab it by the jaw and try to rip it open. I'm gonna laugh when you roll another natural one. Honestly, it, it's happened before. Uh, yeah, that is a natural one. <laughs> oh my! The second punch, though, he does get the second punch. He, he gives him the give him the people's elbow. <laughs> the people's elbow. Hit him with rock yeah, bottom. Yeah, it's happened before. Well, that's a natural one. Yep, uh, that's a seventeen on that one. <sighs> that will miss. Unfortunate. The people's elbow. It was countered. He, the, he, the, the it's the mat. I love not the man. All right, it's all right. The bouncer's just giving Dr. Lee Watts a chance to shine some more. Well, I'll come over here. Yeah, Spades is a tiny can, creature. And I will try to do the same thing that I did before. Do it. Which is a 23 this time, though. Ooh, That'll hit. Call an ambulance. That's attack, too. Not, for all right. not for me. Not for me. That is uh, seven slashing damage. Okay, and sneak attack. Ten. Ten. Sneak attack. That's, a, that's a sandy shark if I've ever seen ah, Dr. Lee Watts dips in again, just pushes spades to the wall and stabs <laughs> it. All right. Nice. Well, you've solved my random cultist puzzle. So moving on, <laughs> Jamie, you're the next to explore. So when very, you said that you puzzles. had a really creative puzzle, <laughs> puzzle to learn, is it just more <laughs> <laughs> that's just that's the, that, that's like, the just wait till you get to my legitimately puzzle. Wait until you get to the next my dungeon. undead dragon puzzle and my yeah. terrasque puzzle. puzzle. Yeah, and, the puzzle. <laughs> and my uh, it's, a, it's a big rock dropping on you. you my Tiamat puzzle. <laughs> the first one had the arrow slits. The second one had the destroyable wall that I didn't think about. I had to blast it open. Yeah. You know. Okay. So, Jamie, where would you like to go? At first, I'd say, like how is everybody? Yes. How is everybody doing? Is what I would say. I, I'm gauging doing health and stuff. All right. The bouncer's not doing great, but you don't need to worry about him. Ruma covered in Kool Aid is gonna give you a thumbs up. <laughs> okay. Covered in Kool Aid. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Which flavor? Oh, yeah, it's gotta really... be the red one. Oh yeah, of course. Yeah. Right? I'm, a, I'm a two thirds. I'm not terrible, but. Can I heal the bouncer? Uh, is it like I, don't, I could it's give a potion to? Technically, a creature. It's a media what? monstrosity. What it's like, a nerd. It, it, it has hit it points. And stuff. Yeah, like, look it up. <laughs> so, I, I think that's something it, I would. It, it, <laughs> I don't think it specifies a can or can't be it, man, it's, it's the nerd. <laughs> yeah, you call for the shadow of spirit to manifest in an unencumbered space. Uh, this okay, corporeal okay, form uses the shadow spirit stat block. Get good, nerd. Wait, hold on, Ethan. Go ahead. an emotion. So someone someone just asked in this uh, random form, can you give a potion to a beast or a monster? This is a monstrosity, but someone did say is yes, as long as it doesn't specify it's humanoid, you can heal it the same way. What I'm curious though is, can you heal a summon with a potion? So let me double That's, check. Yeah, that. I want to. Uh, it is considered that. an ally to me and my companions. In combat, it shares my count, but takes a turn after me. It obeys verbal commands. You feel a nerd in combat. If you don't yeah, issue any, it just nerd. dodges. Uh, and then oh, he's, it doesn't he's have any specification on whether or not it can or can't be healed. It's just it just has HP. <laughs> I mean, it only lasts for an hour, and like I can always just what's summon this, it what's again. What's the spell officially that you're casting? Uh, the you spell is Summon Shadow Spirit. Is the actual name of it? 
But the amount of time it's taken us to look this up, the spell has ended. Yeah, the spell has ended, and the bouncer has disappeared. It only lasts for an hour. It's still a creature. You can heal it with any spell that normally heals a creature. A potion is a magical item, essentially bottled in a spell. Dr. Watts, you may heal the bouncer. If you would like, but I, I wouldn't worry about it. I'm just thinking about like how many more things are gonna come up in the next like hour of time. But okay, uh, I'll th I'll keep that. In the uh, back also, of my at mind. worst, I can just bring him back. It's not. Yeah. Okay. Like, well, then not I'm going yeah, to move. Yeah, I still have 10, one more slot. 20, 30, 40, and then 10, 20 for a dash. It's what a dragon do? puzzle. It's the dragon puzzle. Here's an adult yes, red dragon. Yeah, discovered my dragon puzzle. You discovered the, the three... breath weapon dragon <laughs> puzzle. <laughs> the, the breath <laughs> weapon puzzle. First, you must survive three breath weapon attacks. And then so kill the dragon. All right, three hallways meet in this room. An alcove in the middle of the west wall holds a 10-foot-tall statue gotcha. depicting crude humanoid forms composed of earth, boulder, and sharp crystals. One massive rock fist is raised above its blunt head. Shattered rubble from an older statue lies heaped around the pedestal on which the figure stands. Do I recognize it in any way? You do not. Okay. Um, actually, no. I will. I no. I'm gonna. I'm gonna correct that there. You recognize it specifically because you have seen Sue. Oh snap! So one of these forms is similar to the form that you saw when you were in the other and witnessed Sue. At least in that like visage that she was in oh creepy okay so i'm gonna be like oh dang i'm gonna be yo this is definitely archon avenue i'm, I'm looking at sue over here um i still oh. have 30 yeah, so feet of movement so i will go well, we're okay. in exploration so i don't think it matters oh, what your yeah. oh okay is. well then i go yeah over you here. can just go wherever you want then i go over here and look in here cautiously as a trained thief would be. More hallway. <gasps> you find another oh, hallway. Oh, yeah. Cool. All right, wow. That's all I wanted to do. Wow. More hallway. All right. After Jamie will be Ruma. Split the party. I'm going over here. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> He's going south. Uh, I'll actually continue down this hallway. Not as sneaky continue. as Dr. Watts, but really trying. Good chunk. My, good get... chunk. In chunk, my heavy chunk, armor and my shield. And your plate mail. So one thing you do notice from the uh from your left room is a staircase that leads down. Mm. Well, uh anybody wanna join me while I explore? Oh. Yes, you guys are allowed to come and, like, right. co congregate with me. Is this, like, a, a corner over here? Uh, no, that is a, uh, chasmus pit. Oh. oh, oh, so this is just a one way to that staircase, pretty much. Is there doors or something? Uh, or? no, there's a little bit more there. I'll reveal more. Oh, okay. There's, like, a pathway. Is there, there. A, is there a door there's right a in more, front of me? A little a little more. Oh, there hallway. Oh, there's some right, hallway. I'll, I'll go here. Get a little look. There's do. sand no, people. No. There's so many hallways. It's a big network of hallways. It is a dungeon. Yeah. I, I would argue that this is inefficient hallway placement, and whoever designed this dungeon needs a talking to. Yeah. Someone needs to call up the <laughs> dungeon like they need property the, brothers. The dungeon home makeover. <laughs> yeah, dun extreme dungeon makeovers needs to come in here and right. really. Maybe, maybe their whole thing was hallways. Maybe he saw that they liked hallways. Would people so like hallways to continue in their following Ruma so you don't all get split up like you have been. Yeah. I'll yeah. follow Ruma. I'll, I'll just yeah. Keep I'll just follow. move myself over here. It's the dragon oh, puzzle. Fuck. It's the dragon puzzle. No, that's the stone very porch clearly... in the middle of the room surrounded by pile of firewood. Two big anvils stand close by, and hammers and tongs and other smithing tools are scattered Oh, it's the blacksmith puzzle. Along the chamber walls. There are <laughs> it's the blacksmith puzzle. There are doorways <laughs> to the west and south, but the eastern uh, end of the room uh, opens to a dark chasm. Okay, so there's two anvils? No, it's the Looney Tunes puzzle. Oh, it's the Acme puzzle. <laughs> Wait, what, what, what of this being that is yeah. standing what there? What is this <laughs> yeah, thing? It's I'm such like, a thing, is, man. He is beating on the anvil with a hammer. So, so he is literally honest man doing honest man doing honest work. No need yeah. to bottle him. No need to shove him into the giant chasm. 
Well, maybe he knows where we need to go. That's... Yeah, spark kick him. Yeah, just hit him with the big boot. <laughs> I tackle him into the chasm. I mean, he seems like a good guy. Hey, he's just working. Yeah. Just, yeah, just, just call out to him out. and he's going to run at you with his giant blacksmith hammer. And I don't even know what to ask him, though. Ask him if he lifts. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, room will, room will walk in, like, waving a hand at the guy with, with the hammer. It, he's not even looking at you. His head is down, back facing you, pounding on his forge. Rumo will cough loudly. <laughs> he says nothing. He continues to hammer at his forge. Also, yep. this isn't like, I should admit, this isn't a guy. This is almost like a spiritual, like, fire oh. being that's kind of dangerous. Oh. Yeah, I'm not gonna work in there. I'm just gonna <laughs> nod. He's doing his job. I'll go this way. He's just, he's just an honest fire spirit. Right, I'm gonna peer into spirit. this, and then I think that's enough movement for me. That is enough. Eighty hallways. The oh There's a goodness. way. Uh, so you have. There's more hallways. What'd you say? Yeah, there's a lot of hallways. There's like a. This uh, is like a pseudo like a hallway. Maze. Water. Water fills the uh, marble basin in the middle of this hall, and the walls display an ancient frieze that circles the room. The frieze depicts woodland images of deer, bears, and game fowl being hunted by uh, humanly figures that seem to have a sort of, like, pompous about them. The southeast corner of the room is badly damaged, and the walls there are a little more than rubble. I wonder if he quen quenches his blades here. Yeah, maybe. That's kind of the area. That's like all. Uh, that like a little... All right, uh, Ruma. So we're at Azriel. Where would you like to go, Azriel? Little room. Um. You can go down a hallway, a hallway, or another hallway. I guess I will. I will keep on Ruma's path here. Keep. Even I want to see what's Keep downstairs. on hallway. More hallways. Keep on keeping oh, on. Hi. Whoa! Look at the schmutz. <laughs> yep. More hallways. I will hey. see what's down this one. More hallways. More hallways. For every, every hallway, we discover another I ripped another on two. the designer of this dungeon for all like the hallways, but yeah. there's so many ambush opportunities. Like, oh, this is great for them. Yeah. Who the fuck is this guy? <laughs> Two-headed motherfucker. Uh, it's so <laughs> tunnel that runs north and south both ends of the tunnel have collapsed but the west wall has a set of double double doors with a oh you can't see the message because you're not over on that side there uh there's this guy here though this two-headed guy he's kind of sitting in the corner here picking at his teeth uh playing with his hammer or his club you're muted matt i said oh okay that's interesting what an interesting puzzle we have yeah, now some we guy have playing with his hammer the two yeah, giant had, it's puzzle. the club puzzle now. this room oh you guys are all blocked out now uh -oh. bear on you there we go um is there anything else in this room does this look like a dead end it is not a dead end there is more halls of course there there's always more oh my halls. god yeah. so many halls i guess they call them halsey eight hey. uh, is that the end for my turn or do i get to keep going uh, you just moved a couple times. I'll let you keep, uh, go for one more answer. I, I guess I, I just go to the hallway and see if this guy, like, says anything as I enter the room. Hey there! Oh, oh who, okay. who goes there? I'm Asriel. Just... Oh. oh! I am... I am Noobs! Noobs. Mm. And this is... Blah! <laughs> Not gonna try and say that one. Dude, it's clearly. Okay, oh, yeah, well, you nice. don't speak. Nice Brrr. to meet you. What are you doing in my house? This is your house. I was under the impression this was owned by the Archons. Uh, who is that? But that... you know what that is. <laughs> Very intelligent creature. Yo, poor guy. Well, if that's all, then oh, they're just gonna keep walking. <laughs> yeah. No go! No go! Why? You, you come into Norms' home, and you know bring gift, Norms and Brook. They're very happy. Very unhappy with that. Very, very happy ah. to make it a gift. You need a gift? I can give you a gift. Whoa. Give me that gift. 
Sure. Mm. Let me see what I got here. I will give him a he wooden know you're there stake. Room. He's talking oh. to Asriel. Since <laughs> you want to make yourself known. Yeah, I'll, I'll see how this plays out. All right, uh, I will offer him one, my one and only pixie potion bottle. It'll give him wings and make him tiny. For... Oh, Come dang. That's a do you think, oh, do we accept this? Ah! Oh, we will God. take your gift. He just he holds his hand out to take well, the potion. I will hand it to him. He has it. He puts it in his, his loincloth. Wonderful. I will uh, make It'll my way over warm. this hallway if he doesn't stop me. He doesn't stop you. Wonderful. Yeah, so this place is weird. Yeah, I'm gonna go this way. So right? Yeah. Yeah, where I'm standing. Yeah. Would you guys like to continue to follow? Yeah. Yeah, I guess. If everybody's cool, oh, then no! we're doing what we're more, doing. Uh, more burrow shark. It's the burrow shark more puzzle. Burrow shark. <laughs> It's time for another initiative roll. Um, hey, look at that. I figured out where the down area goes. Yeah. Yeah, that was my whole plan. yeah the down area went to the burrow shark puzzle. That was my whole plan, guys. There's a lot of burrow shark puzzles at this point. <laughs> <laughs> they should just call this the burrow shark dungeon. Uh, my no, this is just... the puzzle dungeon. When... Yeah, that's true. Yeah, this is Let the puzzle dungeon. Everyone... My initiative just Let keeps going down. My initiative has been entered. Uh, My initiative was entered before Eric's. I just want Everyone to good? Know. That's I, what it's all about. I am good. I'm so excited. Nerd. I'm good. <laughs> Damn. You guys will be happy to know uh, that um, your... I was... Yeah, you got higher decks than you. I was prepping die for this because I was going to use physical die, and my cat wanted to play with them, so she now has her own D20 that she baps around my apartment. That's awesome. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> All right, Dr. Watts, uh, you hear Azrael call out more sand sharks, and you know what to do. You are muted, good sir. Oh, dang it. 10, 20, 30, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. And, uh, and, this happens. <laughs> and, and I'm going to try and he moves uh, booming Dr. plate it. Jamie Lee Watts has had the taste of blood and now no one can stop him. <laughs> Nobody yeah, can stop he's him. Bitter. He's bloodthirsty. It's, it's too late. It's 27 to hit. He's getting yeah, the hang baby. of it. Well, yeah. <laughs> he's starting really to learn our it. ways. So that is uh, five. I don't get sneak attack, but um, I will be rolling a d8 for the booming. Yep. That's seven thunder damage. And then the sand is, you know, full of these little cool particles that rumble around that should do something cool if I do it. And then I am going to go... These pillars right here, they go all the way up to the top of the ceiling? They do. Cool. So then uh, it was 10, 20, 30. I'm going to go up 10 feet, and then I'll bonus action, go all the way 30 feet up. Because I have a climbing speed. So I'm 30 I feet just, on this pillar. I just realized, realized that this is not a burrow shark, and the one you the ones you fought before weren't burrow sharks. They're bullets. They're yeah. a different enemy. Right? They're bullets, right? They're bullets. Yeah, the burrow sharks are a different enemy. I was like, wait a second. These don't look like what I remember these looking like now that I'm actually looking at them. So, yes, you're fighting something different in this room. It's not a burrow shark. Oh. This museum's oh. lovely. It's you still do damage puzzle. to it, Dr. Watts, because you still you still hit it. But I'm sorry, how much damage did you do again? It was... Let me go back and look at the... Yeah. I thought you were re-theming it, Ethan. That's why, because I saw that image. I was like, oh, it's a bullet, but I thought you were re-theming him. Um, campaign. Let's see. What do I get? What are the burrow shark or the bullet? They, they kind of... Uh, the Five splashing arc. damage, and then seven thunder damage. And then you said it was a booming blade, so he's yep. gonna be marked. Yep. And his dagger is a right. plus one dagger, so it's magical as well. If that matters. Yep. Yep. Okay. Well, this one's gonna go. Put one in the back. Make sure it can actually do what I just had it do. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. It's going to make a bite at you. It can it do it? I'm thirty feet up. Oh, I forgot you climbed. Yeah, climbed. You climbed. Ah. Mm -hmm. uh, where was he? he was here? Uh, he around there. Mm-hmm. 
I have a climbing speed. Yes, he did. Oh, Ethan. Right, well, we'll not do that. That's why you yeah. confuse them. A burrow shark is the humanoid that rides a bullet. Rides it. Yup. Yup. So it's not All the right, creature, he's... it's the person. Yeah, it's the thing on top. The bullet shark is the person. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the bullet is the mountain. The bullet sh or the burrow shark, weirdly enough, is the rider. It just goes there. Azriel, you're next. It's a weird name Azriel. for it. Feels backwards. Azriel will go. Five, ten, and then you mean sorry, ten, twenty, and then and then we'll uh, whack this guy with the big old okay. one too. Go ahead. Whack him off. That's gonna be a uh, twenty-four <laughs> to hit. Yep, that'll hit. Twenty-seven damage. On the Takes first twenty-seven strike. damage. Second strike is gonna be a oh table please. Um, that's gonna be a uh, twenty-five to hit, and that'll hit twenty-five damage. Takes five damage. Anything else for you, Azriel? Yes, I'm going to bonus action 10, 20, 30, and stand behind this pillar here. So the one below will be able to get the opportunity to yep. attack because he was not attacked. Yep. Yeah, that's fine. He's not going to because it's a 12. Ooh, nice. Well, he tried. Darby. Uh, well, I... Yeah, I'll move 30 feet forward. Uh, and I'll hawk a card, uh, the one that has been booming bladed. Okay. And that is a 23 to hit. That'll hit. Or, uh, 12 force damage. Takes 12 force damage. Second card. Uh, that is a 16 to hit. That will miss it. Yep. Bounces off its hard height. Uh, bonus action. Spades can do things. Uh, that is it Any. for me. Any, though. I mean, he'll try. Uh, and then Bouncer can move. Oh, and it would help if I didn't have the ruler. Uh, he'll go 40 feet up to here. Okay. And he will punch the bottom one twice. Go ahead. That is a dirty 20 on the first. That'll hit. For 12 cold damage. That'll do, don't Takes cold. That'll cold. do, don't care. For 12 cold. It's cold. cold. Yeah. And then he'll go for the second punch, the one two. Big Go wind ahead. up for a 27 to hit. That'll hit. And that's 16 cold damage. Take 16 cold. What and, else for Bouncer? Uh, Bouncer will stand there and crack his knuckles. All right. Be menacing. Go uh, get him, Ruma. Ruma. All right, Ruma, I'll hit him with the Johnny Bravo. <laughs> 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 and, uh, <laughs> you hit him with that. <laughs> and then I'll hit him with the Warhammer. Oh, that pretty much. oh yeah, fifteen to hit. <laughs> that will miss. I'm oh yeah, hard high. I'm doing it again. Oh Who's yeah, again? seventeen oh, to pretty hit. Mama. Meets it, beats it. Pretty mama. Oh yeah, whole mama. Thirteen <laughs> crazy oh, mama. Thirteen. And I'm gonna move it five feet back. Goes five feet back. And then uh, I'm gonna use the last of my move to go there. Sentinel. Uh, 10, 20, 30. Oh, man. Sorry, guys. Uh, what is that barbarian feature in it? I'm gonna put my hands on Darby and, uh, and. <laughs> And give him a big old hug. And he Go. feels, he just feels a little stronger. Yeah, uh, D3 on your attack and ability checks. Let's go. Nice. We're a very touchy feely group. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you guys all love each other. We're very in tune Remember with our what? emotions and that's use right. it as a way to be inspired. Oh, you that's, haven't synced the Every, Everyone's really looking for the last episode of Orgy that we all just <laughs> play through. Uh, 
So Sentinel. Uh, Alright, so Ruma uh, dies this do not, episode. Uh, do not forget <laughs> that you have instinctive pounce as of seventh level. What do you mean instinctive pounce? Uh, it's one of the Tasha's feats for Barbarian. When you hit seventh level Barbarian, when you enter your rage, you get half your movement as part of that bonus action as well. Nick, do you have oh. Tasha's? Tasha I don't. Uh, yes. That's probably why it's not yeah, appearing. Yeah, yeah. He doesn't own the book. Yeah, that, that would be why. But yeah, that is a thing you can do. I didn't remember because I knew it was like a, a later level. I don't remember if it was quite yet. Or I'm not, I'm not raged at this point. An alt feat though, because I no, thought I don't think so. No. out for no, some of them do, some of them don't. The whole like um, uh... it's based on oh, a lot the of the whole, classes. Like, the whole aim thing, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Like like the aim one for rogue is just and it, it's in addition. Uh, like a lot of the ranger stuff is you can pick one or the other, but like warlock just gets things on top. Just yeah. the extra spells, the extra uh, versatility stuff, all that. And it's Barbarian's the same. They just get, like, three new actions. But okay. that is the that uh, thing that you get as well as part of your rage. You can move half your movement. Okay. As part of that bonus action for entering, right? More you know. Yeah. I didn't remember Sorry. if we already hit that point or if it was, like, another level or two. Because I knew it was somewhere in the middle ranges. So, Sentinel, you've done that. Anything else for you? That's it. I'm done. Cool. Uh, uh, you feel you know as, as you feel a little extra lucky now, Sentinel. You're given the health action. Everybody's just rubbing. It's just a massage <laughs> yeah. train of everybody. <laughs> the, rubbing uh, anything else for Spades? Well, spades will just sit there. <laughs> All right, this bullet's gonna move. Uh, Jamie, you get your uh, booming blade oh, damage. Your booming blade damage, yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be two D eight in this mo. At least I think it's plus fifty I'm level. <laughs> All right, so yeah, two D eight. Here we go. Uh, 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 get the bonus. Uh, uh. That is nice. I can't. That is eleven. Ooh, that is okay, a eleven damage. thunder a damage. That's pretty good. Nice. Does it do anything else or do the thunder damage? Just I think. Oh, hold on one second. Uh, oh, yeah, I might do it. I'm just looking at my alchemist just... thing. Oh, Sometimes yeah. I get extra damage if it's a certain type. Um, but I don't think fire, acid, fire, necrotic, or poison. So no, we're good. That's it. Okay, just those damage. All right, you're getting attacked, Darby. Duh. Oh, I'd like to Darby. see you try. He's gonna uh, hit the fuck out of you. The 14. That misses. Beats it, beats it. <laughs> I, I would be very sad if I had a 14 AC. <laughs> All right. Well, I am going to. I'm gonna slide down the pole. Oh. Yep. Whoa. I'm gonna start throwing some silver here. At yeah, I'll take some. I'll take that. Tossing some uh, copper coins out. I will do the same attack at this guy. And Oop, get back here, you. Yeah. Nope, that doesn't hit. That's fifteen. That will miss. I'm going to use my pearl of the unicorn to do it anyway, or to roll it at an advantage. Cool. Oh, nice. yeah, once per day. I I keep well, forgetting we have that. I failed because it was a ten. So that doesn't matter either. <laughs> I also forgot you had that. But good once try. a day, once a day, you yeah, we all have one, and none of <laughs> and us ever remember to use it for any bonus day. action. Ten, twenty, and then I'm gonna move up twenty feet up on this pillar. Okay. All right, this back. one's gonna go, Vruma. Oh, yeah. I'm going to hit the one that's right next to the bouncer. I need you to give me a dex or strength save. Oh, it's not my turn. No, it is not your turn. And... It's the monster's turn. I was so excited. All right, a what or a dex yeah, save? A strength or dex. <laughs> strength for sure. Wow, 13. Oh. You fail. So good. the creature jumps upon you and begins mauling your face. You are going to take 3d6 bludgeoning. Doubt it. Uh, that is going to be uh, 12, 16 bludgeoning plus 9 slashing damage, and you are knocked prone as the creature is on top of you. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm going to use my stone's endurance to do a 3D or to do a D12 plus 3 and maybe get some of that back. Yeah. 
Asriel, you're next. Alright, Asriel will go uh, 10, 20, and strike this guy in the face. Go ahead. That's gonna be a uh, 25 to hit. Go ahead. Nice. Big damage coming through, hopefully. This one goes down. 30 damage Ooh. on that first strike. The bullet the bullet turns to sand. Yeah. Thank you. Now I can throw cards um, without this And then um, I am going to bonus action dash my way 10, 20 back behind pillar. That's it. Okay. Darby, you're next. Uh, I guess I will go... And 20, 30 up next to the pillar. Okay. And I will huck some cards. Huck some cards? And I get a D6 Yuck on top, em. or a D3 on top. Uh, so that is uh, 13 to hit. Miss. Hold a 1 on the D6 and a 3 on the 20. Love to see it. Uh, second card. That's a little bit better. Uh, that is a 19 to hit. That will hit. For 7 force damage. Take 7 damage. Uh, 7 whole damage. Uh, bonus action spades can attack, and then Bouncer will go, because that is all I can do. Uh, Bouncer okay. will snake around over to here. Then he'll go here. 40. Uh, he's gonna okay. start swing. He's gonna he's gonna curb stomp the the thing while it's mauling Ruma, I guess. Sounds good. Don't miss. Just kick it in the the back feet or whatever. Get uh, in the back. Twenty five to hit. Front feet. Yeah, that'll hit. <laughs> <laughs> Which feet? In my dick. Uh, it's crying. Five plus eight pain. is thirteen cold. 13 cold takes 13 cold. Uh, and then he's gonna go to punt it for the second hand. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like an Ewok in The Force Awakens 2. Uh, go ahead. Dirty 20. Yep. 16 like cold. An Ewok in The Force, Force Awakens, Awakens 2. That was an achievement. There's an achievement in that game to punt like 30 Ewoks or something. I don't know why, but that's what they did. It's 16 so cold damage. Force Unleashed. Oh, yeah, Force Unleashed. Sorry, yeah. Oh, is it Force Awakened? I was like, what yeah. the hell is the Force of Awakened? Sorry, I, I had Yo, Awakened in my brain. I thought it was the classy yeah, porn too. parody of Oh, Force no. Awakens. Yep, the Force Awakens too. He's really into the plot. Yeah, no, it's a good, it's a good How story. The acting is great. Punning Ewoks right on his Force dick. Okay, wait, don't oh, my God. 16 cold. <laughs> it takes 16. This is devolved into yeah. madness. This, What's this happening? This is really gone What's off happening? the rails. I'm not really right, sure whatever this is. What else for you? Let me check the move here. That would have been 30, so I'll... He'll go 10 more feet up, so he's a little bit more out of the way. That's it. Alright. Ruma, bad. I know I said it's on top of you, but technically you're just knocked prone, so you can just use half your so He just knocks you prone. Can I use my full movement to do a cool kip up? Sure, if that's what you wanted to. All right, I'm using yeah. full movement to do a cool kip up, and it's you impressive. Did that. He kips up like Shawn Michaels at WrestleMania. Shawn Michaels. <laughs> and then uh, I'm gonna hit it twice. The fact that that man can kip up, up as late in his it's career like... as he could is insane. <gasps> Net twenty. What, what uh, cool animation did you get this time? Uh, it was like a shark that like circled oh, the die. Somatic. Really cool. Like, oh, that was a new one. I haven't, I haven't seen that. It was yet. a burrow shark. How All right. How healthy is this one? It's not super healthy. You might get it depending on how well you. Yeah, you All might, right, you might not get this one. Uh, I forgot. But what is a paladin crit damage. without a smite? <laughs> Thirteen pet damage. Unfortunately, you do not get it. Ooh. But I can hit it again. Well, he does have a second hit. Um, no, I can't. He's gotta get you a magic weapon room. I think everyone's got a magic weapon, but... I mean, he has the I magic weapon make. spell. So he, True. Yeah, he, but that requires concentration. I know, yeah, it requires concentration, <laughs> and you can't have shield to fade limit. Room is all about tank and not yeah. that damage. That's true. Yeah, yeah, damage, is, damage is for losers. True. <laughs> it's for losers. <laughs> And uh, I, I rolled a 13 in the second one, which I imagine doesn't hit, yeah. so uh, yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna revel in the fact that I did a cool kip-up. 
<laughs> Dude, who cool kept up? up? Sentinel has the option of taking this. The kill down. steal. The kill Here I steal. come. <laughs> I am Cinnamon. Here I come. I am Cinnamon. Uh, and you do have the help action right now. Oh no! Sentinel, That's... I think you're on the pillar. That's you just a nat twenty. As long as yeah. from the high bar. Yeah. <laughs> Jumping off the top, bro. <laughs> and at 25. Great damage. It had 4 HP and turns to sand. Nice. nice. That's what we wanted. You solved my burrow shark puzzle. <laughs> oh, gosh, there's so many puzzles. Oh, no. <laughs> this is the most okay, puzzly dungeon we've been, been in so far. Oh, must have had you think. Yeah. And there's more right. hallways. Darby, back to you at the top of the exploration order. Yep. Oh, what, real quick hallway. before you do before you do go, Darby, you just see Destiny just kind of running behind. Oh yeah, I forgot up. he was here. I forgot Destiny was <laughs> he's just here. <laughs> he's 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 fine. You keep it up, <laughs> all right. I mean, we're gonna keep going. So fast through these places. Well, well, yeah. My God. yeah, that's what we do. I told we you you didn't want to be here. Like eight things. <laughs> in like the span of 10 minutes. I literally told you you did not want to be here. I wasn't pretending. Oh my gosh. Okay. Make sure you oh scream my... loud if something comes to try and kill you so I can run back and save you. No. What in the goddess's name was the two-headed thing back there? Uh, mm -hmm. No idea. But Norg, it... Norg and Bran. Yeah, something Bar like that. <laughs> I tend not to talk to the things of the dungeons. It's not really my thing. <laughs> Understood, uh, or understandable. All right. I will uh, Darby, look down the hallway down here. It is. It's a cool little empty hallway. That oh, it's a, to it's a dead end. Ooh, All you've right. You've been bamboozled. Excuse me. Right, change of plans. Your... It's another eight hallways. Oh, yeah. yeah that's, let's go. Oh, that's, that's your whole turn, Darby. Okay. Remember when we told Ethan <laughs> that our campaign doesn't have enough hallways? <laughs> <laughs> so we got a dungeon of all hallways? All hallways. Well, I heard you liked hallways, so uh, I put some hallways in your hallway. It's like the Dorgen. Ooh. The dungeon of oh, doors. Off, slightly off subject, but I was going through Tales of the Yawning Portal for the next, like, big dungeon I've been working on for you guys. And they have Dead and Fey, which was, like the scenario they released when they were playtesting 5e and that thing is ridiculously huge in like a mess of hallways i was like this would literally take you like a month to get through that's how big this is uh, right. anyways darby you may continue well, to do that whatever is, you like to do. Uh, a... as a heads up there is a giant chasm here with a single stone pillar that people can jump across if they need to if they mm. need to well the nice thing is... How much time has passed? At this point with the exploration and stuff, probably about a half hour. All right, so okay, so then we don't have fly are gone, yeah. But Spades does have a 60-foot fly speed. So I doubt we really need to go check out what's up there. I think we know what's up there. I mean, we can only know for sure. There could be more hallways. That's than, true. Than I'm going to send Spades over there. And use all an all action all. to use his uh, senses, because I, I don't have the cool thing where I can always use the senses. Alright, one sec, one it. sec. Come on, swap over to the one that lets me... Do he does have 120 feet of dark vision, too. Which is like... Oh my god, there's There no are hallway. actually <laughs> more hallway. <laughs> That's what I wanted. I Sweet. Will, I will oh. relay back to everyone. There are more hallways up there. <laughs> do we want to check them out? I think if we, we need to go back, we can, but I think we've got some zesty Yeah, we have more places to go. Here. Okay, I will have Spades. Yeah. some more zesty yeah. always. I will have Spades come back. Uh, we'll, we'll go we'll go back this way, say hi to the big two-headed man, and and work our way back around over into this room, and I'll check out the, the bottom hallway. Oh my all god. Right, people... Ruma's just people zipping all over the place. I'll bring the bouncer. <laughs> It's about half an hour's past. Oh, there's more people! Uh, <laughs> it's, right. another oh, it <laughs> it's, it's another puzzle. It's another cultist puzzle. <laughs> well, as you peer in, Darby, you see uh, these three what look like cultists skewered on meat hooks, oh. writhing and screaming in pain as this burrow shark stands there, tormenting them and laughing maniacally. Oh. Wow. Whoa! Whoa! Hey. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead. You should uh, just close the door. I'm gonna, I'm gonna back up. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna let oh, the sorry. bouncer initiate. 
I'll, I'll tell the bouncer to, to just like step in and I'll just stand there cracking his knuckles because he can't speak. Menacing me. The, the yeah. burrow shark turns to look at you. The bouncer can see an immense amount of madness in its eyes and it just begins to laugh in the bouncer's face. Ugh. Well, oh, so you went crazy. Yeah. Um. Ooh. This one's an actual burrow shark, too. Alright. Yeah, this is an actual burrow oh, shark. This that's time. Right. Yeah, it is a, it is a different uh, icon, that is true. Uh, honestly, I'm gonna just tell the bouncer, punch it. That's right. Punch it, Chewy. That's an initiative roll, it's, everyone. It's, I'll just tell him, punch it. All yeah. right. So I'll just hold the door, I guess. You're about to solve my mad executioner. <laughs> no mad executioner. <laughs> well, my initiative didn't change, but Spades did. Spades got even lower. Nope, oh, even lower. Keep, you know, keep getting lower. I have been rolling lower, lower and lower each time. This is the first time Can I have you not go down low in the initiative. <laughs> All the way to the flow. Excuse me, this one is also not a burrow shark. It is oh. just the rider, not the actual thing. So it is a Ooh. Oh. When are we ever going to find this shark? I don't know. I wanted to know where the actual burrow <laughs> the shark is. The burrow shark. There's that's... not actually a burrow shark in here. That's that's the it. That's it. There's just no actual burrow the shark. The boss. The big, ba the, the the big, the big boss the, is just one big, big burrow shark. shark. All right. Everyone everyone in? Yay. Uh, yeah. 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 No ties. Uh... I think Jamie's got a higher dex than Rumor, so I'm almost guaranteed. I don't know that. I don't know that Rumor. What's your dex? Like Fifteen. Oh. Yeah. Wow, you're very dexterous. What? Yeah. I mean, dex is like one of the power stats. That's true. <laughs> it's know? the one that gets. It, what's the one that gets your AC? So. I don't know if you're wearing heavy armor. Also true. Ten. Yeah, he, he doesn't 20, need it as much as Attack. Attack. Give me that attack. That's going to be uh, 21 to hit. That'll hit. Yeah. I'm just going to keep this as a sand burrow shark in the count. Even though it's the writer. Twenty-five damage for strike. It takes twenty-five Ooh. damage. Second strike is twenty-five okay. to hit. That'll hit. Dang. That is a two damage roll. Oh, no, it takes two damage. And then I will. Um, oh, I did. That was movement action bonus action. I can't do yeah, that, but I'm stuck there. You're standing there. Dr. Watts. Okay. Um, I'm going to go 10, 20. Now, I'm going to use a bonus action disengage to okay. continue moving 30, 40. Now, you said these people were screaming in pain. When I look at them, are they sand people? You'll have to cut them and find out. Well, I'll just there's, do a medicine they're check. Skewered. Well, they're skewered. Do a medicine I, check. They're skewered. Yeah, yeah, they're skewered. Yeah, they're skewered. So I would, like, I would assume they, I would see blood. They are skewered. There, is no bu there are no guts coming out. So. Oh. oh, okay. So then I can tell that they're more sand people. Unless the DM's tricking you. In which uh, I'm going to make a medicine check anyway. <laughs> Go ahead. You make uh, a horrible it's a 14. Break your vow. He's a real person. Uh, you kind of examine it, and as you touch it, it begins to scream and writhe louder. Uh, but it is definitely not human. Oh, well, that doesn't matter to me. There's a lot of species out there. Is it like a person, or is it a sand creation is what I was I, looking it, for? It's a sand creation. Yeah, a sand oh, person. okay, cool. Well, then I want to move over here, and then I'm going to... Do I still have an action? You your or is that my action? action. Yes. Bonus action. Then. Okay, well, then I'm going to actually stay over here, because I don't need to go over there. Okay. The end. Ruma. GG, GG. Ruma will move 10, 20. And then he'll get really angry of that there's so many hallways that he can't move. And <laughs> um, he'll use a bonus action to dash. To, there are there. So many he can't hallways. use a bonus action to dash, bro. Or my action to dash, and then that's it. Hey, that's our I'll thing. My, yeah, I'll use my thing. bonus action to tell Azriel to shut up. <laughs> Do you, <laughs> you shut up? I can dash you the bonus action if I want. Yeah. Uh, that slow punk that we could do whatever we want to do. <laughs> Go ahead, Darby. Uh, I'm assuming I cannot see him from here. 
So no, you cannot. Uh, well, you need to be where your buddy is. And I'll go, I'll go 20, I'll say hi to the bouncer, I'll chuck some cards, and I'll go 10 feet back out of the you will be a disadvantage your next. Oh, game. that's right. I will be. Right. You know what? Never mind. Enter I will, the room. Come I will. Enter the room. I will just stand back here and and be like, "Yep, you guys sure have fun with that burrow shark." Uh, oh. and bonus action, space can attack. I guess. Everybody, boo, Darby. <laughs> boo. Uh. I'll use my action to boo myself. Uh. <laughs> Good. And then, uh, I'll go to the bouncer. You, you should be booing uh, yourself. The bouncer will snake 30 feet around and start okay. swinging. Go ahead. Uh, that is a 26 to hit. That'll hit. For 13 cold damage. That's it's hard. 13 cold damage. The it's second swing. That is a 22 to hit. That'll hit. Or 18 cold damage. As the bouncer strikes the stone melder, its right. body begins to become engorged and it bursts, sending out a collection of stones all around it and hitting everything within 10 feet. I need Azriel, Ruma, and the bouncer to give me a dexterity saving throw. <laughs> Just Azriel, you get plus four. Ooh, I yeah, do. you are within his aura. Yeah, man, I got an eight. Uh, uh, plus a D four or just a straight plus four? straight plus four. four. Yeah, you get his charisma bonus as an addition. Uh, so that's a twenty two. And the bouncer okay. gets a twelve. Uh, let me see. So the bouncer and Ruma will fail Azrael because you're a uh, rogue. You will take no damage. Both of you guys are going to take, if I can see my freaking dice, uh, thirteen points of bludgeoning damage. <clears throat> Bouncer is Ow. flickering like crazy and has almost dissipated. As the executioner fades away and the boulders that blast it out disappear, the three men upon the hooks uh, awesome. vanish as well, their bodies turning to sand and almost dripping off like water. Wow. Oh. Okay. Ooh. Good. Well, we solved. Puzzle, yeah, we figured out the puzzle. There's a lot of like sand things. Where are we supposed to be going? That's. I don't know. I have no idea. Like, this thing is just... I don't understand how any of this relates to the girl up back up at the top. Honestly. I think she's the goddess. I'm, I'm starting to think maybe we should have brought her along because she might know where to go. We're kind of just aimlessly wandering around here. Yeah, no, if you're asking me if anyone would have been a better choice than Destiny, the answer is yes. You are correct. <laughs> I mean, he's just here. More liability no, than anything. No, if no I look at the pontiff. Well, we're gonna put her in danger, especially with all these uh, enemies around. I guess. So. But we're also putting the pontiff in danger right now. Is that not also danger? It, uh, he handled himself a little bit better, and. Uh. <laughs> I mean, she had she brought someone back to life. I'm I'm sure she can do powerful things. She did something to a corpse, but yeah, sure. I don't, I don't necessarily know that he was brought back to life, but he was seemingly brought well, back to life. We, I, we saw it, so... Yeah. I'm just going to push past Darby and be like, maybe she can cast Fireball. <laughs> oh, uh, no, Seno, you'll be the I don't know that spell, go, but... Seno, go, go! Go, Chicky! Explore. Here I go. I'm exploring the brave new world. Hey, well, weast. Oh, oh, it's the giant puzzle. God damn it. <laughs> a, thick, a, a, a single thick pillar supports the low barrel vaulted ceiling of this unlit chamber. Rusted scraps of metal, the remnants of breastplate, shields, axes, and swords hang from the walls of old pegs or lie on the floor where they fell long ago. More recent clutter in the form of filthy, filthy furs and splintered wooden furniture also lies scattered about the room. A broken pile of chairs and table legs lies next to the smoky fire pit on the northern side of the room. Doors lead to the east and the southwest. And there's a bunch of ogres just wandering around in here. It's the ogre puzzle! <laughs> are they are they aggressive? They are like onions. Uh, they have layers. They are uh, pretty dumb. They haven't noticed you yet. I will stand still. 
and wait for my more they stealthy. Uh, I will stand still. They can't the see you. Stand still in the room, in the in the space one back of you. There you go. All well, right. You can't see I him will. if you stand still. Yeah, There's exactly. Like I'm just like a door. Yeah. He's just a big yellow door. Yep. I'm going to sneeze really loud. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't to do anything with this, with this specific room. I mean, there's a hallway, guys. There are more hallways that way. And this is a convincing path, but so is going downstairs. Yeah, there's actually stairs. Yeah, there are also stairs that we have completely <laughs> and ignored. And this guy that kind of freaked us out a little yeah, the bit. Weird right, well, you know what? Let's, let's see if we can sneak into that room. Do we want to try and sneak past the ogres? Can't Darby just cast invisibility and go I check it out? I could, but that kind of apps me out of all of my magic for a while. That's okay. Why do you do throw cards anyway? Uh, yeah. Oh, you know well, I'll, I'll summon the bouncer <laughs> occasionally. Thank you very much. I will, uh, um, I'll try and sneak. I'll try and do it. I'm gonna use All right, give me a stealth him. roll. As also, I don't think I have enough really target. There's not to sneak here. Um, but I'm I, muted. I, I That's why have a, a no one heard me. You want me to roll at a disadvantage? Yeah. Because there's really nothing besides this main pillar for you to sneak no around. No problem. I was going to say a whole bunch of things, and I did, but I was muted because I'm eating chips, and I'm trying to be respectful. Oh, wow. That's pretty <laughs> awesome. Um, it's how they get you. Uh, I rolled yeah. a 19 and a 17, so 17 plus 13 is 30 stealth. What the fuck? The ogres do not see <laughs> Expertise, you. Expertise, baby. This is, well, I was going to say, welcome also to, like, mid-level Dungeons yeah. & Dragons, where just your ability score checks that you're proficient in just... Are ridiculous. Yeah, I mean, my sleight of hand is also a plus 12 right now because I'm proficient and I have real. expertise. I have For a plus your 9 30 plus. that you have rolled, you find a deck. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You know what? Well, we figured it out though, guys. Yeah, no, we got I we know. got information. We know that this is not I worth will it. I'll go back if you want me to roll another stealth check to go back. Everybody shout. Yeah. Everybody yeah. shout, uh, hey, Azrael. Is that who was down there? I'll come back to the group and say you'll never believe what I found in there, guys, and then I just I tell them and keep walking. <laughs> I'm going to assume it was a hallway. Never believe it. I'm going you to. Did. I'm going to attempt to read Ezreal's mind. No. It's a hallway. Uh, it, it's a hallway. Is, that, no, is there anywhere hallway. else you'd like to go? Uh, no. I mean, well, the stairs that we were. Talking about the stairs, but... and there's another hallway, right? like uh, literally right next to where we went down. <laughs> so, Jamie, there's also a hallway way up at the top. Too. I'll check out these stairs. I mean, there's a hallway here too. Doctor Watts, as you enter into this room here that leads to this spiral staircase that I'm just blacking out even further because it's yeah. gonna change for me. Um, you find an interesting uh, deposit of ore stuck into the wall over here. It's a yellowish, kind of glittering, glowing ore. I would like to mine some of it with my hammer. It was Jamie who found it. I would like to take some of that. I guess. Yeah, it looks yeah, interesting. It, it, it is very interesting. Uh, you'd probably need to use Ruma to mine it, though. You need something. Wait, can to I do a, like, some sort of check to see what it is? Uh, are you nature? proficient in like any type yeah, of nature? Geology? Would probably be Something like the closest nature, thing because it is. Yeah. It, it would be a natural thing in the world. I'm not proficient in it, but I did find it. I should still be able to roll for it, right? Uh, yes, but you probably wouldn't be able to 100 percent discern what it is. At least not off the back. You'd have to study it a little longer. Yeah, that's cool. I've seen everything that's ever existed. So <laughs> that is true. Fourteen. <laughs> It is okay. a glittering yellow piece of ore. It's very sparkly. Okay, well then I'll just be like, there's some glittery ore here. It looks interesting, but... I'm going to hit know. it with my hammer. It could just be something that's on the wall. <laughs> All right. Rumi, you hit it with your hammer. It explodes. All of you... No, I'm kidding. It bonk <laughs> chucks off. All right. <laughs> it explodes for 37 D6. I'll give the chunk of ore to Jamie. I'll say, well, thanks for this rock that you found. <laughs> I got it. That I don't know is anything of importance at all. I think it'll be someone later. 
I will put in my item yellow sparkly rubber. Welcome. Or. And you take the stairs down to uh, the next layer. Dun, 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 dun. You know what? Yes, and I do so quietly and sneaky. You may do so quietly and sneaky. I'm going to Loop. reveal the downstairs area real quick. And I, I feel like this has enough hallways to be considered an urban environment, and therefore I move <laughs> twice as fast. It's basically <laughs> just city streets at this point, with how many hallways there are. Oh. I've decided. Yeah, oh, at what point does a dungeon become an urban environment? Yeah, what, yeah. What point does a dungeon become a city? Whoa! Oh, Depending on how many fuck! Minions. What is that? Well, we don't know because we can't see it. Right now. I'm assuming. Well, I can see it, and it's scary. This looks like something that would come out of Arkham Horror, the new living card game. It's not new. It's been around for a while. I'm trying All to get right. sponsored. I mean, hey, yes, I'm I'm all here down. for it, honestly. Yo, I play so Why much Marvel Champions, it's not down. even funny. The stairs lead down to an uneven, rocky platform. The chasm continues downward almost endlessly, and at the end of it, pitched on the edge, is a steel beam affixed to the stone flooring. Placed upon the beam, arms stretched, uh, an almost human-like shape hangs. It is triple your size of the largest member of your group, and though he appears to be young, uh, there's a strange uncanniness about him. An endless supply of blood trickles down from the fresh wounds in his wrists and feet. Is he upside down? He is. Fun. Does he look vaguely reminiscent of a particular Sue? Uh, he does not look oh. like Sue. Do I recognize this person at all? He does look a lot more like a humanoid upside down. Do... With your uh, infinite knowledge obtained from Sue, you realize mm -hmm. this is one of the Archons, Jamie. Oh! It's both me and I right. have seen Sue, so that's why I asked. But that, yeah, that's great. Well, time to kill an Archon. I don't I'm gonna... think that's the thing we want to do. I'm gonna be Can I get to it? Yes, the platform is rickety and rough, but you may walk across it. It's I will. It's just a bit unstable. Walk across it with my cat cat burglar like reflexes. If everyone would like to follow, yeah, I'll follow. The, the archon opens its eyes. Welcome, welcome to the temple of the archons. And that is where we will go ahead and end tonight's session. Since we only have uh, five minutes, you guys have to wait who you're dealing but, with next week. But, but. But, but what who? about the guy? He yeah, seems like he's having guy? a good time. Interesting. Yeah, his come. bleeding seems to be in a good mood. And why yeah. is he upside down? <laughs> Where's like the bat. rest of the temple? <laughs> I have so many questions. Who's the fiery guy? Can he make me a magical hammer? Maybe. You didn't ask him. You just yeah, didn't he just walked in and went, you were nah. Maybe. Maybe that's all he wanted I to mean, do. I mean, he was a hard-working guy. I respect the... You know what? Yeah. On the way out, we're asking him if he can make me a magical fire hammer. <laughs> it and just does also... plus one fire damage. That's it. <laughs> and it's considered magical. It's going to turn out to be uh, the ultimate bad guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that I black know, guy. We already know movie. who the ultimate bad guy is. That's true. It's the elephant from yeah. that one thing. It's the elephant. I've <laughs> said it, and I've said it, and I've said it a million times. We already know who the ultimate bad guy is. The must. So, so, didn't mean to cut people off, but, I mean, I never do. It just kind of always happens. Uh, for those that don't know, Exclamation Point Vault pulls those up. Check them out. Um, so if you see the next days when they go live, I know I kind of jokingly said it earlier, but literally that is the case. Um, I should be good to be streaming this week. Last week was very chaotic, but with it being a lot of midterms and stuff leading me into this week, which is a break. I'm going to be on uh, spring break, I guess, technically, or living a break, I don't know. Uh, one of those. So that's fun. Uh, so I'll definitely be streaming this week. I don't know what, though. It's probably going to be more, like, played up and, like, fighting game stuff and all kinds of shenanigans. Uh, until next time.